good. I don't care. Be no, a care. good I cameraman, care. okay? No, Sam, you heard me. No, Sam, no, you heard me. No, be good. Sam, Sam, what I say? Be good. I'm not your wife. Sam, okay. be good. Okay, okay, he will be good. He will yeah, be good. Yeah, yeah. Time for us. The Ross said be good. He's be good, good and he will be good. Be good. good. Be good. He's good and he will be, be more good. Be good, Sam. He will be more good. Huh? Okay. It, 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 call, call, it, call it out, call it out, don't worry. Are, are you guys set up? Yes, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, time fast, time fast. Yeah, okay. Okay, so Ross. No, wait, wait, wait. Wait for me. No, wait for him. Ah, okay, fine. <laughs> yes, this is what I me. want. Make sure you time it. Stop, Stop being so damn slow, Sam. Yeah, Speed up. You're, you're, you're not yeah. the coward. Huh? You're not the coward. Uh, I'm proud of that. But Bob's definitely not a coward, Saraj. I swear he's the coward. He, every I, time, I, I disagree. Every time Bob's a great I warrior. In, how come? Ask, ask the same question that Bob asked you. Yeah, I will ask. According to the Quran, who is the person time. that asked? Yes, I will. According to the Bible, no, also. No, no, no. According to the Quran and according to the Bible. No, no, no. So, both, both, both. You're a coward, bro. Oh, why are you not talking now? Tell him to behave. Tell him to behave. JC, behave! Behave, JC! How oh, you look how we do it? No, this is what I want. Behave, JC, behave. behave! Behave! Okay. Don't be scared. Dawa boys. Uh, do, 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 I, do I get a, get a mic or not? Haters! All of you! Okay, fine, whatever. Okay. Um, Sam, define pagan. Huh? Define pagan for me. No, wait, wait, wait. wait Sam, wait, pagan wait. literally no, means non-Christian. No, are you a Christian? No, if you're not a Christian, then you're no, a pagan. Please, please. No worries, no worries, no worries. Come on. Okay. Are you already? I'll come to that question as well. He um, said non-Christians are big pagans, yeah? By, by definition. According to him, the prophets are pagans because they were not Christians. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, all of you flopped. Okay. So now, do you want to start with the question that Bob was asking the coward? Give me one second, sorry. Is is the camera set up for me or not? Yeah, it's really Where the hell is he? Is it recording? Or is it not recording? It's recording, it's recording. Let me just clarify that. Give me one second. Let me get JC. Keep that one. Yeah. Just one second, one second. Keep it, keep it recording, keep it recording. Uh, where is he? Sorry, 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 sorry. Uh, it says recording there. Sure. Okay, cool, thank you. All right. Okay. Don't worry, uh, the, it's here. Yep. Don't worry, it's here. Okay, awesome. How's everyone doing? I'm here with the uh, with the lovely Siraj. Siraj, yeah. how would you like to do this? Um, I've seen your debates before. At some point, it starts off calm, and eventually it gets heated. Do you want to just carry on with that same pattern? Do you want this to us to time things? Do you want to raise a point? I raise a point. What do you want? I want question and answer. Timing. Yeah. Question and answer. Timing. timing. Uh, how long do you want? Two minutes. Okay. Do you want to start? Or should I start? And you start, and then uh, I'll ask you. Be before we start, can I just clarify like what what your yep. Sorry, okay, can I, can I clarify what your like uh, Akida is? Like, like what is your, what's your belief system? Are you Sunni? Are you a Hadith, Sunnah and Quran? Are you something else? What are you? What are you? The same, yeah? You uh, tell, tell me. Yeah, sure. I'm, I'm, I'm ecumenical. I don't subscribe to just one set of Christianity. You I believe in Trinity? I believe in the Trinity. I believe that the Bible is the inspired word of God. Oh, Trinity I believe as, in, in, I, as in how? Trinity? Uh, Trinity as in God is one, one in being uh -huh. and three in persons. And uh -huh. I believe in the entire history of the church. Okay, so, okay, and you tri Trinitarian, basically. sure. And, and what are you, Sunni? Uh, sorry, Sunni, uh, like I'm Hadith. The, I'm the strict one. The one uh, Christians don't like it. Okay, so what? 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 What are, what are your? What are your points Salafi. of? Okay, and so, you, so your the points of reference one. are the Quran first or, or second? Quran and Hadith, both. Okay, but what was the Sunnah? Sunnah is the Hadith. But but like the Hadith is like separate from the Sunnah sometimes. No, it's no, not it's the same. Sunnah. It's not one it's and the hadith. same. You cannot Quran yeah. and Hadith always are together. Okay, fine. Okay, so if I bring up things from the Hadith, as long as they're Sahih, you're happy, right? No, we want to talk. Yes, we want to talk okay, about. Okay, fine. So okay, what? listen. We want to talk okay. about the foundation of your religion, of your belief. And okay. I'm talking. I'm going to talk about the foundation of my about okay. my religion. All right. So when you're asking me questions, you need to yes. ask me the foundation of Islam. And I'm asking you the foundation of 
Christianity. So are, are you the, base, the root of Christianity? So are you? Because if the root is wrong, the branch is false. Okay, so are you restricting so what, what I can about talk about to only fundamental no, things? Yeah. No, the branch, the root. The root, yeah. Yes. So whatever you bring up is going to be root based. Yes. And nothing else. Yes, nothing else. Okay, fine. All right. So, uh, do you want to start? Or shall I start? Shall I start? Oh, yeah. Do you want me to explain first of all uh, Alpha yeah. and Omega? Um, okay, fine. I would like to go How, however, yes. if you explain it in a way that I don't agree with, because I was right there, I'll clarify some things. Is that clear? Uh, doesn't matter. Actually, Don't wait. You, you came secondly. You came secondly. So let me start, and then you can jump in from, from when, when you came. Okay. Okay. So Bob was two minutes. Two minutes. Yeah. Please. Yeah. Go ahead. Two Any, minutes. Anyone? Two minutes. Anybody? Two minutes, please. Okay. I can do it. Yeah. Two minutes. All right. No, it's better someone else. Otherwise, that is going to distract you. It's just You're timer. going to forget. You're going to forget. Can what somebody please to say. time two minutes? Anybody? Two minutes, young boy. Thank you. Two minutes. Timing. Yes. Yeah, Stop watch. No. Yep, yep, ready? Yeah, start, let, let him talk. Okay, hello everyone. Yeah. So, what was happening before was Bob was having a discussion with a Muslim, okay? They were talking about uh, the differences between the Palestinian-Israeli conflict and how that represents exactly what Muhammad was doing in the 7th century when he encountered others who didn't meet his ideology. Eventually then, uh, one of the hecklers uh, told Bob to show him proof where within the Bible it says the words that uh, Jesus is God or Jesus says I am God verbatim. Bob was going to show the Muslim exactly where that was and refer to Revelations where Jesus was called the first and the last and he was going to compare this with how in the Quran Allah is also called the first and the last. Essentially to prove that in order for you to have a core doctrine in your belief it does not have to be stated explicitly within your text for it to be true. In the same way that if you look in the Quran and say and uh, f try and uh, find a verse that says the words Muhammad is a Muslim, in order to prove that Muhammad is a Muslim, you will not find this. And then therefore there must be some kind of other way for you to understand core parts of your belief without only referring to uh, words that are said in an explicit manner. So Siraj came in at this point and, and, and started heckling a little bit. So Siraj, uh, carry on. Well, what did you see? Um, shall I answer that question? Huh? Okay, okay. So, so. Okay, so are you happy with my description? Are you happy? Okay, yeah? So no, I will talk a while. Okay, okay. So, Siraj came in. How long have I left? Okay, Siraj came in and basically said that he could answer where, or, or sorry, or, or um, he could answer the question that Bob presented, being that Jesus in the Revelations is called the first and the last, and so is Allah in the, uh, in the Quran. So, therefore, unless it can be two first and the last, this verse in the Bible is saying that Jesus is equivalent to Allah in that he is the very beginning of things and also the very end of things. And then Siraj says that he can answer the question as to why Jesus is called the first and the last in the Bible and why Allah is called first and the last in the Quran. So he has to rectify those two things because otherwise the answer is that he, Jesus, is God. I'm done. All right, set two minutes please and then let Siraj know when you're ready. Okay. Three minutes. Huh? Three minutes. I, I, think, I think two is fine. I was done. Well, uh, let, let's see. Let, let's do it again. If you want more time, we can do more time. Okay. Are you ready, or, or should we should we wait? Yeah, I'm, I'm ready. Ready? Hold on. When I start, yeah. Okay. So, uh, Siraj, it will help if you have your sources ready while I'm talking. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I, I'll do something for you as well. Okay. You guys can cut this part if you want. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Now. Ready? Start, yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Start, please. So now, yeah. Start. So basically, I'm going to answer. The same question as Bob was asking me and what he was also asking Muslims, the Muslim brothers. Mm -hmm. So he said, who is Alpha and Omega? Mm -hmm. Which means first and last. If we go to the Bible, many Christians do not know the definition of first and last. You can't just say, if it's like me saying, behave, yeah? tell him to behave. Hmm? Tell him to behave. JC behave apparently. <laughs> it's like me saying I'm Alpha. It's like me saying I'm Alpha and Omega, first and last. But in order to justify my claim, I need evidence. Right? Otherwise, if I just say blindly I'm last, first and last, no one could believe me. No one would believe me. Okay. So in order us to believe Jesus is Alpha and Omega, mm -hmm. we need evidence and proves from the Bible. Okay. And Christians always misquote that verse, where Jesus said, I'm Alpha and Omega, first and last. Okay. I'm going to refute that verse in many verses of the Bible, 
I'm not going to use my logic. So, in the Bible, 30 seconds. Okay. Hurry up, Suraj. Hurry up. Hurry up. No, I, I will answer. No, no, no. Suraj, we're doing. Wait, pause, 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 pause. Sorry, sorry, sorry. We're doing time. I need Suraj, to... we're doing timed. So, like, talk sorry. faster or something. Anyway, the other two minutes, I'm going to explain the same. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Yep. Huh? 30 seconds. Well, how is he? 30 seconds. 30 seconds. You post it. Yeah. How many seconds? 30. 30, 30 seconds. Yep. Okay. Doesn't matter. Okay. Okay. So now I'm saying, first of all, Christians believe Jesus, there was a time Jesus was dead. My question to them, how can a dead person be last? A dead person cannot be last. Therefore, Jesus is not last. Again, Jesus is a prophet. According to the Bible, in many verses, the Gospel of Luke, the Gospel of Matthew. The Gospel of Matthew, Jesus claimed to be a prophet. Chapter 13, verse 57. Again, his disciples called him a prophet. Luke chapter 24, verse 19. Again, the people called him a prophet. Siraj, okay. okay. I speak All right. Later. So, as usual, Siraj, unfortunately, has mischaracterized what is going on here. The question was asked, that if Jesus is not supposedly God, as is said within the Bible, but not in those exact words, then how can he be the first and the last? AKA, like unlike as Suraj said, Christians understand what this means. Jesus is the very first of anything to exist. He is one with the Father. He eternally proceeds from the Father, and he is the, the end of everything that there will be. He is immortal. He, sorry, eternal, sorry. He has no beginning whatsoever and he has no end whatsoever. So when he says that we misquote this, because Jesus in his human form died on the cross, that would it somehow negate the ability for him to be the first and the last. Suraj is quoting an atheistic viewpoint. Because Suraj, even yourself, when you die, when your earthly body passes away, your soul and spirit still exist. So essentially, you never actually fully die and not exist at some point. In the same way, when Jesus died on the cross, in his human form, his divine nature never died. So he would still be eternal and therefore still be able to be counted as the first and the last. So the problem remains, if this is the, why Jesus is called the first and the last, because he's eternal, he is the beginning of everything and he, he will surpass anything else to ever exist, then therefore, how can he be the first and the last and Allah also be the first and the last. Either one of them is lying, they're maybe both lying, or somehow there are two people who are the first and the last, Jesus and Allah. What do you think about that? How long? Okay, he's comparing yeah. here. That's fine. Uh, uh, so, minutes, yeah. we, we, we do, we do, yeah. Yeah, so two minutes again? Yep, okay, go. Now he's comparing Allah and Jesus. Yes. Many reasons, Jesus is a prophet, but Allah is not a prophet. Allah never died, Jesus died bodily, even if we say that, but the Father, the God, the Father never died, whatever, even bodily or physically or spiritually, but Jesus at least died and he was buried according to you, therefore, according to, the, according to Paul himself said in the book of Timothy, chapter 1, and two, and one Timothy 6, 16, it says, God is immortal, yes? Agreed. And he lives in an approachable light. Does Jesus live in an approachable light? No. In his divine nature, yes. No, no. Nowhere in the Bible it says Jesus lives in an approachable light. Nowhere. Again, God of the Bible, God the Father, the God of Jesus does not have God. But Jesus have a God. So the true God doesn't have God. That's why God in the Old Testament said, I am God, there is no God beside me. In Isaiah chapter 45 verse 5. He said, there's no God beside me. In order God to have a God, there must be another God. Therefore, there's no God beside God. And Jesus have a God. How can Jesus be God? Okay, let me come to the point Alpha and Omega again. Yes, he please. Said yeah, Jesus, that, that, that's the question. He said yeah. Jesus is Alpha and Omega. In the Bible, according to them, in New Testament, it says in the beginning, there was a word. My question to them, God does not have beginning. They believe in the beginning there was a word, the word was with God, and the word was God. So my question to them, how can Jesus be God when he had a beginning? And in the Bible, in Old Testament, it says God has no beginning. But Jesus had a beginning. Again, if someone could be God according to Christian's logic, Melchizedek should be God. Why? In Hebrews chapter 7 verse 3, it says, and Melchizedek has no father, you has no mother, seconds. no end, no beginning. 
So why Melchizedek is not God Time. has no beginning, okay. has no end. Time. But Jesus had a beginning and he died. Okay, we got, we got, we got your okay. point. Right, awesome, point awesome. again. Yep. Still. Stop, please. So the problem still remains that Suraj has not answered why Jesus is called the first and the last and Allah is also called the first and the last. I am looking for an answer to reconcile the two. Again, are there two first and last or is it Jesus is the first and the last and Allah isn't or is it the other way around? You haven't answered that particular question. You haven't because all you've done is tell me reasons why Jesus isn't God but you have not told me why no he's called the first and the last. Okay, you mentioned that because it says that God or the Father is in an inapproachable light and it doesn't say the same thing for Jesus, that he's not God. Well, for example, it doesn't say that about Allah. So is Allah not God because he doesn't meet the standards of the Father? Maybe that could be the case. However, when it comes to the incarnation, which is what you're confused about, the incarnation says, or the doctrine of the incarnation says, that God, the Son, who is eternally, um, eternally from the Father, uh, who, by the way, has no beginning. And when you hear the word beginning in the New Testament, it means before there was time. It's biblical language to, to state something. It doesn't mean that he was the first thing to be in creation. It means that before there was ever even time, Jesus existed with the Father and the Holy Spirit. That's what that means. But you're getting confused with the incarnation, where Jesus, the second person of the Trinity, comes into earth as a, uh, as a human being. He's a human being, sorry? Sorry, he's a human being, but he still has his divine nature as well as a human nature. So in his human nature, he is capable of dying on the cross, but his divine nature is eternal. It cannot die. So don't think that because he came here as a human being, that that's all he is. Yes, he's a prophet. Yes, he, he, he prayed to God, but that was him as a human being doing those things. Jesus has a pre-existing divine form as the second person of the Trinity. And that is something that you need to address as well as why he is called the first and the last and so is Allah. You need to explain that specifically to me because you haven't done so yet. All you've done is tell me that he's not God. Yep. Okay. Again, if I say Jesus is not God by using many verses in the Bible, that means Jesus is not Alpha and Omega. I said in order, if someone claims I'm Alpha and Omega, I, don't, I need proof evidence that indicates you, Jesus is Alpha and Omega. And I said I give many reasons which Jesus makes him not to be Alpha and Omega. So now, my second question is, according to Old Testament, Paul is the only person who said Jesus today, tomorrow, and to yesterday, and tomorrow is the same. If Jesus is a prophet, he agreed with me. And in the book of Zechariah, chapter 1, verse 5, it says, Where are your fathers, forefathers? Where are the prophets, ancestors? Where are your ancestors? Where are the prophets? Do they live forever? That means all prophets must die. And Jesus is a prophet. When Jesus comes down, he comes back, he will die. According to Zechariah, chapter 1, verse 5. And I said Jesus is not Alpha and Omega. If Jesus could exist as he said, I'm asking a question. I'm, I'm starting my questions now. So Jesus, what does that mean for the time? Should I yes. stop the time or what? Yeah, no, I'm asking a question. You can talk after I ask you. So now he said Jesus existed before the world was created. So my first question no. to him, wait, as he said, he said Jesus existed before the world was created, mm -hmm. which means before prophets. So now I'm asking, if Jesus existed before the world was created, that means prophets of the Bible in Old Testament should practice Christianity and should worship Jesus, the Holy Spirit. So now I'm asking now, show me in Old Testament where Jesus existed or was worshipped by the prophets of the Bible. Did all prophets of the Bible practice Christianity or Judaism? If no, what's the difference between Judaism and Christianity? That's the first oh. question. Now I'm going nice to timing. ask him questions only. You can yeah? Talk. Okay, and I, I yeah. can ask you questions only as well, right? Yeah, you answer my right. question. Can you ask me this, please? No, no time. For, don't time for you. No, I want him no. To Do you want I time? get two and then we start okay. timing. Okay. okay, two please. Did you answer my question first? Wait, sure. before I start. We can go back to that again. Okay. Again, Suraj has not been able to answer why is Jesus called the first and the last. All he's saying I'm is denying the divinity. I just proved to use it by other You didn't do that. You have not told me why he is called that. All you can tell me is that you can deny his divinity and therefore escape the idea of answering the question. But that is not answering the question. That's the problem. For example, he can ask me, why is Allah the first and the last? And I can say, I don't believe Allah is God. That doesn't answer the question. 
I can de de deny Anna's divinity, but I am not answering the fundamental question as to why he is called the first and the last. So, when he was talking to me just now about uh, the, 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 uh, the Zechariah quote that said that prophets live and die, Yes, prophets live and die, but Jesus is more than just being a prophet. We don't believe in Christianity that he will come back here and die again. He will come back here and rule over the entire earth, unlike the description that's given within Islam. And lastly, he talked about the prophets uh, not following Jesus as, as being Christians. In the time of the old prophets, in the time from, uh, from Abraham, uh, uh, particularly from Noah, all the way up, up until Malachi, the understanding there is that these people uh, uh, held strict adherence to the law of God that was given to Moses. That was what was necessary at the time for salvation, not following Jesus Christ. We are differentiated as Christians from those prophets in that we now have the luxury of having Jesus come here in, in, in the person and act out an entire life for us to replicate. That does not mean that the prophets like Abraham and prophets like Moses are not in, are not in heaven currently. That simply means that the covenant that we live in is now different from the one they lived in. In the one that they lived in, they were capable of attaining salvation through adherence to the law, and we attain salvation now by grace through faith. So they don't need to be Christians, they need to follow the law in the Old Testament. Is it done or what's up? Yeah, that's fine. Cool. So now we're moving on, on to questions and answers. Okay? Okay. So now I'm saying he yep. didn't answer anything. He said really? he said okay. the prophets had new and uh, different covenant than Christianity. Absolutely. My question to you, my uh, the way I'm going to refute is okay. new covenant does not mean new religion. He said Jesus existed before the world was created, which means he existed before the prophets. My question to him is if Jesus existed before the world was yeah. created and before the prophets, how come prophets of the Bible, none of them worshipped or practiced the triune God? How come if you are saying Jesus existed before the prophets and you believe Christians, Christianity means anyone who follows and worships Jesus and believes the triune yeah. God, that means the prophets of the Bible are not Christians, but you believe they were Judaism, uh, they practiced Judaism. Yes, they did. And Judaism does not practice the concept of the triune God. Therefore, according to you, you are telling me Christianity is the correct religion over the, the religion which all prophets of the Bible practice, which is, according to you, Judaism. So are you telling me prophets of the Bible were wrong because they never worshipped Jesus and the Holy Spirit, they never practiced the triune God. And now again, I'm going to educate you. So wait, wait no, finish. no, Saraj, Saraj, wait. one question, one question. Okay, wait. one question. Yes. Okay, and I'll give you one answer, and I'll ask you a question, so, okay. and you can come back, okay? No. Okay. No, I'm coming to refer to the Alpha yeah, and Omega. I am going to ask you a question now, okay? That's fair, that's fair. No, you didn't answer my no, question. No, no, I will answer question. the question and I will ask you a question, okay? You answer my question first. Okay, I another question. What's again, my question? you repeated it. You were telling me, okay, yes. so again, for Saraj's sake, no, no, it's fine. Thank you. It's fine. I'm going to go. For Saraj's sake, he is telling me that I am telling him that yes. we are in a new covenant. And because we're in a new covenant, that does not mean, according to Saraj, that we have to have a new religion yes. compared to the older prophets who yes. were not privy to the New Testament, right? I am telling him as an answer that in the time of Moses, in the time of, of, of um, Abraham. Oh, oh, no, not Abraham, but in the time of, of Moses, in the time of David, in the time of Solomon, in the time of Isaiah, in the time of Daniel, the way to attain salvation was adherence to the law. No, 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 no. Listen no, to me. I'm talking about the triune Saraj, God. Saraj, no salvation. Saraj, stop. No salvation. Saraj, stop. Okay, thank you. Stop, Saraj. Okay. The way to attain salvation was to strict adherence to the law. Yes, there are some prophets who had a deeper understanding two of minutes. the person of right. God. Really? Two minutes. Really? We've got about two minutes again. I thought okay, we were doing okay, question, question. It doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah. Because, okay. Does yeah? Because no, you're not letting me fine. speak. No, Saraj, no, Saraj, no, Saraj. You ask a question, I'll give okay. you an answer, and okay, I'll ask you minutes. one. You answer me, and then you can give me a question. Okay. Okay? In the time of those prophets I mentioned, yeah. the way to attain salvation was through strict adherence to the law of God, the law of Moses, and the, and, and the, the Ten Commandments. Okay? In accordance with them believing in a triune God, we believe in the idea of progressive revelation. So, aka, David knew more about the person of God than Abraham did. Because David has the, full no the past knowledge of how Abraham interacted with God as well as his personal relationship with God. So more prophets as they go on in age learn more about the person of God. 
So I cannot say definitively that any of the prophets realized that, that there was a Father, a Son, and a Holy Spirit, but there are allusions to that in the Old Testament. For example, David knew God as Father, and he also said in the Psalms, uh, cast me not away from your presence, O Lord, and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. So he understood that God was his Father, and he also had a Holy Spirit. So the more we go on, the more we understand about, about God. Christianity is the full revelation of the person of God, okay? And that's how we know that God is Father, God is Son, and God's Holy Spirit. But now, now, I give you a question. No, no. No, that's what we agreed. You will come to that afterwards. You haven't answered this We'll come to that afterwards. No, you haven't answered. So, Suraj? Okay, Suraj. for me two minutes about this No, 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 no. Two minutes. I get to ask the question now. No, two minutes. Okay? Because you never answered anything Pause for a moment, please. Suraj, you agreed twice to what I said. you confused about God being... Suraj, you agreed twice to what I said. can I speak? No, because if... Okay, so, Suraj, Suraj, Suraj. You're mixing things. Okay, Suraj. You're mixing about now we're getting to the point where this conversation is about to break down. Jesus. If you simply adhere to the rules that we set out before, then we remain cordial. Two minutes, please. Two minutes. So you might have to be in two minutes. You might be back yes, to that. I want two minutes because you're not okay? letting me speak. All right, fine, fine. Okay, you can go stop. Two minutes, Let right? me speak. But okay, now, now, now that means that we can't do question and answer okay. anymore. Yeah, two minutes, yeah? So now, just wait. Okay. Later, later. Thank you. Exactly. Go ahead. Okay, now, again, he came, he diverted the topic I did not. by talking about different laws and talking about different covenants. But Suraj, don't you but know these I things? They're fundamentals of the faith. What I say, look here, look here. If he's trying to justify his points by using the prophets different times, a different law, but yes. still the prophets, though there were different times there, still they, according to them, Christians, they believe all prophets of the Bible practice Judaism. The religion was the same, still one. Even Jesus' time, still, God did not reveal himself as a tri be as triune God. Do you know why? Because the God of Jesus, even Jesus until now, his God is not triune, three God, three persons in one. Because Christians, logically, doesn't make sense. They believe Jesus is the way and the truth. If Jesus is the way and the truth, how come the God of Christians is three persons? God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. But the God of Jesus is only God the Father. That means even Jesus now, the God of Jesus is only God the Father. Therefore, you stand for nothing. Jesus, God did not reveal himself, never ever being triune God. Otherwise, the God of Jesus could be what? Three persons. The God of Jesus is only one person. And Jesus worshipped only God the Father. But Christians worship who? God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And yet, Jesus is the way and the truth. Christians, empty words, where is the evidence? Action speaks louder than a word. If Jesus worshiped God the Father alone, why Christians, they worship God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit? And none of the, none of the prophets practice, none of them practice um, the triune God or worship Jesus and the Son. I mean, Jesus and the Holy Spirit. Okay, cool. You done? Yes. Okay. Two minutes. Please, two, two, three, yes. two minutes. Yeah. I guess we'll carry on for that for the function. Cool. Awesome. So, again, Suraj has not actually answered the question, and he has gone back on the words that we talked about previously for a question for a question. Now he wants to go back to having everything be timed, which is fine with me. So, Suraj. Fundamentally, your problem here is that you don't understand the fundamental doctrines of Judaism or Christianity. You don't understand that in the past, like I told you before, you did not need to, uh, for example, uh, uh, in the time of the, of the uh, Old Covenant, right? Jesus had not come down in the Incarnation to die for our sins and be the bridge to which we attain salvation with God. To attain salvation with God at that time, you used the law. The law that God gave to Moses. That's how, how, how you, you attain salvation. Secondly, like I told you, we have progressive revelation within Christianity. You get to know more about God uh, uh, the, the longer God goes on. Again, that's the same thing with... Um, said this before, yeah. That's the same thing, by the way. But so are you. The that's the same thing with the Quran. That's the same, same thing with the Quran. No, no, no. Who knew Silence. more about God? Ib Ibrahim? Who knew more about God? No, Ibrahim or Moses? Or Ibra Ibrahim or Muhammad? Obviously, the further along you get, the more God reveals himself to you. So again, you don't understand core Christian doctrine. Christianity is an extension of Judaism. We're not supposed to be supposedly two different religions, but there's an understanding that in Christianity, we have the fullest revelation of who God is. 
in the same way that you think within Islam, you have the full salvation of who God is with his two right hands and his shin and, uh, and, and things of that nature, which we, we, don't, we don't believe in, Off right? No, 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 it's, it's not, oh, I can show you the hadith, which I can bring up later. How long what? Awesome. So effectively, you are you're, you're mistaken and you're confused because you don't understand Christianity. You don't understand what Christianity is, unfortunately, and you don't understand what Judaism is either. That's your problem. So if you had a, a, a uh, like a if you had a, like a world knowledge of what these things were, you wouldn't make these mistakes. Two minutes. Okay, now off topic again. How so? I'm, I'm going to explain. Okay. Still now, I'm saying. Jesus now, according to Christians, mm -hmm. Jesus is a Jew man. Even now. Sorry? Jesus is a Jew man. What do you mean a Jew man? A Jew man, he, he's a, he practiced Judaism. Well, you, well, 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 even now? Jesus, yes, now. He said we worship what we know. Even now Jesus worship God the Father. Show me where he says Jesus does not worship God now. I can give you in the Bible, even now Jesus worship God the Father. So therefore, the God of Jesus... Okay, go ahead. Look, logically, uh. we Muslims make sense. All prophets of the Bible practice... Two right hands doesn't make sense. All prophets of the Bible right in Islam. All uh. prophets practice Islam. And we practice Islam. But Christians' logic, all prophets of the Bible practice Judaism. But Christianity practice... The Christians practice Christianity. Because therefore, they're trying okay. to say two religions, one book, Bible, two religion in two religion one bible but two religions islam we believe all prophets practice one religion so we believe we mm -hmm. used they used to have different law and different covenant but the religion still is the same but this guy is trying to justify his point god did not reveal himself being a triune god so now michael um, he's trying to say basically god of the bible chosen Christi christians over his prophets impossible i never said that that's what you said. I didn't say that. why do you know I didn't say that. No, let me finish let me finish I didn't say that. You know that? That's a lie. no 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 according to you the way you speak because you're telling me god yeah. well, behave behave yourself according to him god did not reveal himself as being him being triune god his prophet's time prophet's time but but okay, that's christians, not what i said either wait wait jesus time he believes god revealed himself him being a triune god again now even jesus Five time seconds. even jesus time god was not triune god why because jesus the god of jesus the man this god is only one god the father one person therefore there is no triune even until now can I have two minutes, please? Okay. Effectively, again, the same problem persists. Saraj doesn't know what Christianity is, he doesn't know what Judaism is, right? And he raised an interesting point that I, I want to harp on for a second. He said that they believe that every, um, every prophet of the past practiced the same religion, but had different covenants. We believe the same thing too. Like I told you, Christianity is an extension of Judaism. So the, I said nowhere in the past that Jesus, uh, or, or God, God in particular, has cast away his old prophets. His old prophets, Follow the law to the letter. So they will attain salvation. They were not wrong in what they were doing. But in that time, they worshipped what they knew. Okay? So what they knew at the time was at least for certain prophets who had a more progressive revelation of who the person of God was, that God was at least a father and he had a spirit. And Daniel in particular was waiting for the Son of Man to come in the clouds of heaven, which Jesus did. Or, or, or will do at the end of days. But the reason, for example, why Jesus was crucified in the first place, I bet you can answer this. What did he do to be crucified? Why did the Jews want to crucify him? Can you answer that real quick? Second. Why did the Jews want to crucify Jesus? Do you have a quick answer for me? If not, you can answer in the yeah, next one. I got the answer. Okay, cool. They misunderstood. Ha! Okay. I perfect. got the answer, yes. I perfect. can give you from okay. the Bible. All right, cool. Yes. Well, well, go ahead and do that in yeah. the next Shall I give? However, the real reason why they crucified him was because he claimed to be the Son of Man. The Son of Man prophesied in Daniel 7 14. The one who was supposed to come on the clouds of heaven and have and, and, and subdue the entire world and have the entire world be inherited to him. He claimed to be that person. That person is God. And that is why they crucified him because he was committing blasphemy in their eyes. Okay, uh, but, 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 second. And, and again, fundamentally, Siraj, your problem is you don't understand what Judaism is, you don't know what the law is, you probably don't even know what the Ark of the Covenant is, and you're trying to tell me that God has cast away his old prophets. I never said that, he did not, they fought the law perfectly, so they are, have attained salvation as well. So here again, I'm, I'm repeating again. Yep. He's confusing between the salvation, new covenant, and new law, and different law, but 
He's not Those getting are all the point things. where he's not getting the point. I said that the law can be different, the covenant can be different, but the religion cannot be different. If all prophets of the Bible practice Judaism according to them, okay. and they practice Christianity, so my question to them, how come one book, one Bible, but two religions? So An extension. according to them, wait, wait, let me finish. An extension. That's so all they believe Christianity is the correct religion. If the Christianity is the correct religion, that means Judaism is wrong. Otherwise, he has to admit. Incomplete. He has to admit. Incomplete. That's Judaism all. is right. If he says Judaism is Incomplete, right, that's all. so if Judaism is right, or Christian, either two religions cannot be wrong, cannot be right at the same time, two different religion, Christianity practices triune God, but Judaism don't practice triune God. That means one of them must be wrong. Until now, Jesus is Juda practice Judaism. Because that's why Jesus said in the book, in the Gospel of John, chapter 4, verse 22 to 23, Jesus said to Samaritans, you do not know what you worship. We know what we worship. The word we means Jesus included himself and his disciples that they all worship God the Father. Okay. He never said sure. the truth. He's, he never said we worship what we know. He never said we worship Jesus himself. Wait, wait, he never, he, he, wait, that's wait, what he wait, said. That's actually what he said wait, the first wait, one. Wait, that's wait, what he wait. said. He said we worship. That means Jesus himself worships God the Father. And he included his disciples that they all worship God the Father. If Jesus knew or believed that his disciples worshipped him or the wise people worshipped him, then it's pointless Jesus to deny and admit that him and all his disciples worship God the Father. And he said the true worshippers will worship God the Father. He never said the true worshippers okay, will worship so Raj, God the Father. Okay, you're going over, the you're going Son over, Spirit, you're going over. The triune is mad. You're going over. Mad. Okay. Two minutes. Can I stop, please? Let's stop. Okay. I want to say it again, but you know what I'm going to say. Siraj does not understand Christianity or Judaism. I have said four times now. Okay, now I'm asking uh, questions. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Judaism, uh, Christianity is an extension of Judaism, okay? We are not saying that the Jews are Two wrong in what religion. they believe, but they have a different understanding, an incomplete understanding of who the full person of Two God is, religion. and that's revealed in Christianity. Secondly, you were different books. Secondly, you were you, you were talking Wait. about um. Uh, wait, 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 I forgot what your other point was. You no, talked about my uh, question. Now, no, 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 no. What was the other point? What yeah, sorry, sorry, my bad, sorry. You talked about uh, Jesus saying we worship what we know to the Samaritans. Yes, we believe that when Jesus was incarnated, he was incarnated, and he, uh, he as being the perfect God, was also the perfect man. So as being the perfect man in that time, he kept wholeheartedly to the law, which is a good thing. However, what Suraj is going to tell you is that multiple times across all four gospel accounts, Jesus Christ is worshipped as God and accepts the worship and never once tells them not to worship him. That is the thing Suraj is not, not He just corrected. He said we worship what we know. I'm but asking then that. he also... No, okay, no, 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 no. Pause. I got time. Hold up. Okay. So, he also says that he is one with the Father, that nobody knows the Father but him, and no one knows him but the Father, and those who the Father choose to reveal himself too. We believe in something called the hypostatic union, that Jesus Christ, as in the incarnation, was both a, had the, the, the nature of a man and the will of a man, as well as his divine nature and his divine will, all in the person of Jesus Christ. Don't forget, like I said, he was worshipped multiple times by Peter, by Thomas, by many people during his ministry. And he never once said, don't worship me. But at the same time, he followed the law perfectly. And don't forget, the law says, have no other gods but me. But somehow Jesus was okay being worshipped as a god. So you have it wrong again. Back. Okay, so now I'm asking a question now. Wait, because so are you going to just answer my point? Round, round. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, we're, we're so going to change topics. time to expose him now. Expose I'm me! Tired of repeating expose me! Over and over. Let me hear it. I will play the game now. Okay, okay play Okay, now my first question is Let me hear it. Is, okay. But I get to ask you questions okay, as well. Yeah, you can ask me. Now, so, pause, pause, question. pause, pause. Okay. So Raj has said that he will ask me a question, I will give him an answer. I will then ask him a question, he'll give me an answer, and we will go back and forth until he gets tired. Ah, okay, that's right, that's right. Yeah? Okay. Don't change it now. Go. Okay, yeah, no, no uh, time, uh, no time. Okay. No for time. now, please, don't, don't worry, right? But if don't it changes again, now. it's his fault. Yeah, okay? no, Thank don't worry you. for now. But, but if you don't let me talk, or if I don't let you Saraj, talk... Saraj, no, let me explain to ask you. Ask the question, I'll give you an answer. Yeah. And I'll ask you one, okay? Yeah. Okay, let me explain that. 
If I don't let him talk, then timing. If he doesn't let me talk, then timing. But wait, but if you, you wait, have to what if you talk, you wait, talk. wait, what if you talk longer than me? I and then and, and then you stop me. I just want an answer. I, I just want an question. answer. Yeah. Ask I just question, want an answer. answer. So now you. The be, more okay. complicated your question is, yeah. the more complicated the answer will yeah, be. Okay. okay. So now I'm asking so you. So you better say, ask three so questions. So now I'm going to I'm coming to refute the triangle. Yeah, so now I'm asking, bro, brother, wait, Both. please wait. Yeah. Brother, wait, please. So I'm now I'm asking two easy questions. One question. I'm no, no, no. One. 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 Okay. So okay, one question at a time. Yeah. So now I'm asking. As he said, Jesus had two natures. Agree? Yes, okay, right. And he believes only God can be worshipped, yeah? Okay. Yes. Okay? So that means Jesus, the man, he had two natures. One nature, human being, and the other one, divine nature. Good. Nature, yes? Good. So that means according to him, and he believes only God can be worshipped. Yep. Agree? Listen, everyone. He's going to come to the point now. So my first question is, okay. if Jesus had two natures, Yes. And you believe only God can be worshipped. Yes. Did Jesus worship Jesus the man? Did he worship the, uh, Jesus the divine nature? <laughs> and who do you worship? Did Jesus the man worship Jesus okay. the divine listen, nature? Yep. Let's, nature. Le, let's listen very carefully. Listen. Who Jesus. Do you, okay. Who do you Jesus worship? Jesus while on earth. So I worship the triune God. Uh, who? But listen. Listen. Yeah. Okay. Let me. Catch hey. No. Point. Yeah. yeah. So rush, Are so you so finished my that question? Was the question. question? That was the question. That was the question. Let me answer it now. Okay. Okay. I worship the triune God, the Father, the, the triune God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, right? Okay. Now, pause. Okay. Pause. Wait, you pause. Answer. You didn't answer. Pause. So rush. What did I ask Let you? Let me answer. Okay, what did okay. I ask you? You asked me, when Jesus was here, did he pray or worship his divine nature? Yes. No, Jesus had two natures, yes? And you and asked you, me, did he worship his divine well, nature? Let me finish. Nature, Let me explain it to you. Saraj, so if you repeat what I just okay, said, no, you didn't understand. You asked me very no, distinctly, no, did he worship I'm his divine nature? I'm saying, I'm saying, yeah. wait, wait, let me repeat. I'm saying, he believes Jesus is God and human as well. So two natures. So, but him, listen, listen, how double standard is him he worshiped jesus god the father the son which is jesus and the holy spirit exactly. but i'm exactly. asking exactly. so everyone has to worship the same god the exactly. father the son and the holy spirit exactly. also jesus the human has to worship how many three if he doesn't worship three of them that means triune god doesn't exist so i'm asking did jesus the human i worship, got you the first time so why jesus are you wasting my time worship did jesus the human worship his jesus divine, the divine nature and the holy i heard spirit? you the first time no, 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 Saraj, man no, no, no. okay no, no. okay Saraj has wasted my time okay. by talking about the same question twice okay, okay. Answer. Okay. Saraj, answer. keep quiet okay answer. Quiet. so as a christian i worship a trinitarian god thank you i believe that jesus is god the father is god and the holy spirit is also god and this is backed Wait. up in scripture. Jesus, as a perfect man, kept wholeheartedly to the law. So he worshipped the Father. Now, who do you worship? because Jesus worshipped the Father, persons. that does not negate me also worshipping Jesus because he also said, and Saraj is forgetting this, that he is one with the Father. If there is one God and Jesus is claiming to be what one with the one God, then I can worship both Jesus, uh, God the Father, Jesus Christ and the Holy Spirit, Spirit, who he said, by the way, that if you blaspheme against, that is the sin that God will not forgive. Why would God not forgive you for blaspheming against the Holy Spirit? Because the Holy Spirit is God. For you to blaspheme, you can only blaspheme against God. So. Now, Suraj, my, no, my, my no. turn no, 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 to no, ask no. you a question. Conclusion. So, yes. no, 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 Suraj, I am going okay. to ask you a question okay, you and you're going to answer it. I'm going to, Suraj, I'm going to Suraj, expose you what if you, you said. If, if you're a Salafi, you if no, you're a Salafi, I'm going to that means that you said. keep to the idea no. that the I'm Quran is uncreated. So, if the Quran is uncreated, Suraj, right, can you explain to me why it contains very clear errors? He contradicted his own Suraj, I get to ask you a question. Now. Okay, question. everyone listen. I told Suraj yeah. that he would ask me a question. I would give him an answer and I would ask him a question. Yes. Now Suraj answer. is not he wanting answer. to answer the question answer. that I am about to See, ask. Even the sister so said Suraj, you didn't answer. Sorry? The sister here said you didn't answer what? my sorry. question. Did you hear my answer? Yes, wait, wait. Don't worry, don't worry. Maybe okay. Question. So now, okay. listen. Okay. So, okay. So, I talk and then no, you, you can't answer, talk. Okay. I talk now. I talk now. So, 
I talk now. I talk now. Thanks. I know, okay. but he heals me on So now, okay. Uh, uh, now, I will let you no, ask me. My turn. I will let you, now, I will let you ask Quran, me. No. Okay, wait. If you believe okay, wait, wait. that the Quran is on creation, I, I want wait, you to wait, explain wait, to me wait, how Allah wait, has wait, all the time in the wait, world, wait, right, wait, wait, to wait, figure wait, out the most wait, clear wait, way no, of no. communicating his message no. to okay. human beings, okay, right? However, in the Quran, you have things that have no no meaning whatsoever. Alif Lam Mim, Alif Lam Ra, Yasin. But then for some reason, this is meant to be revelation from God. God has all the time in the world to come up with these uh, uh, revelations. The but for some the reason, he decides to include things that have Abhidhan. no meaning that Abhidhan. only he can understand. Abhidhan. Can you explain to me explain why to the Quran is supposedly uncreated and God has all the time in the world to write down what should be in the Quran, but he starts writing things that make no sense to human beings? I'll why is that? Wait. Okay. Before I answer his question, oh. I will answer his question. No, yes. no. no, no, no. That's not no, the format that we agreed. That's not the format we agreed. Answer the question, no, no, and then you ask your question. Because you didn't answer my question. Answer the question, yes. and then I'll answer your question. Look here, I will answer. Siraj, no. listen. Okay, okay. Siraj. Okay. Siraj. Siraj. Okay. If I answer, Siraj. then wait. I can Siraj, explain wait. what you said. Siraj, wait. Okay. Do you you agree do this a lot. Okay. I think it is better and more constructive for everyone okay. watching if we agree with the format. Question, Good. Then Go for it. I'm going to explain your point. Answer my question yes. and then feel free to give me a question. Okay? No, no, no. After I answer his question, I need to expose his. You better be fast, though. God. Don't take too long. Yes. Yeah, okay. 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 So, the Quran is uncreated, right? The Quran is uncreated. The, the Quran is uncreated. Yes. Yes. Allah had all the time in the world to form the most perfect message ever for you to understand. Yes. But then he starts writing random scribbles that mean nothing. Alif okay. Lam Ra, Alif Ram Meem, uh, so Yasin. Why has one? God included these things if he had all okay. the time in the world and the Quran is a clear book? Okay, I will answer. Why is it there? Right Thank you. I right like now, that. Right that. I just Let's answered go. last week no, that no. question. Sure thing. And now I'm repeating answer again. Now. Okay, go for it. Answer if you go right now and then ask okay. a question. No, it's, no, it's, yeah, it's fine. I answer, I need to Siraj, go. Siraj, go. Okay. Get away. Last week go. I answered and now I'm repeating again myself. He said if the Quran is clear and is uncreated. And God had all wait. the time in the world yes, but, uh, to write it. Let me speak. Go for it. Let me speak. Yep. I'm down. What? But you won't come a second ago. Why, why should I be calm? Okay. So now I'm saying he said if the Quran is clear. Uncreated, uncreated, had all the time in the world to write it. How come? Alif Lam Ra, Alif Lam Ra, what's that mean? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Go ahead. I'm just making sure you're keeping the question. answer. Simple. Let me hear. Okay. He said if the Quran is clear mm -hmm. and is uncreated, mm -hmm. how come some words in the Quran no one knows the meaning? Yes. The answer is simple by reading Quran chapter 3, verse 7. Oh, what? I already told us the Quran is two parts. Before you ask me that question, Claire, you need to ask me, the Quran is how many parts? Two parts. Okay. And Allah said one part, no one knows except him. I Allah see. Allah said, no one knows its meaning except Allah. Okay. So Alif Lamim, Yasin, Saad is one uh, one of the words no one knows but, except but Allah. Allah. Okay. But the ones we know them, it's clear. Okay. So in that verse, Allah said Quran is clear. How Quran is clear? By understanding Allah has divided how many parts into Quran into Quran. Quran has two parts, and I said unclear and clear. The unclear ones, Allah said, in, even in the Arabic, the Quran I'm reading in Arabic now, and I'm going to explain in English. Allah said, Allah is the one who revealed the kitab, the book upon you. And Allah said, part of it is unclear. No, clear. And wa ukharu mutashabihat. Many ayat of Muhammad wa ukharu mutashabihat. And others are unclear. And Allah said, He told me the people Allah turned away from the Quran always criticize and try to use the those verses, ones. the unclear ones. Uh -huh. Allah already told me right. 1,444 years ago uh -huh. that this kind of people yep. are going to use the words are unclear. And Allah said, Those who their hearts are illness. They always criticize and try to follow the unclear, the unclear ones. ones. Okay. And Allah said, No one knows its meaning illa Allah. The answer is there. If I say my house is clean, but some rooms are dirty, is my house clean? No. If the Quran is clear, but some of the things in the Quran have no meaning, is it clear? No. Two parts. In order you to understand the Quran, 
Quran has two parts. One of those statements That's is wrong. That's the key of the procedure of the way to understand. Every book, everything has its procedure. Maths, it has, it has formula. So if why doesn't the Quran the form, say wait, wait, that it's finish. partly clear? Let me finish. So wait, Suraj, Suraj, sh should that verse be the Quran is partly clear? Let me finish. Can I finish? So In can we correct that you verse? To understand, everything has its procedure. Okay has got a way to follow and to practice and to pr and its procedure. Okay. If you don't follow the formula of maths, yep. mathematics, you get lost. Algebra, sure. okay. every maths, circumference, is got formula. Okay. Quran is got procedure. Okay. If you don't understand that verse before you go to the other verses, you will not understand Quran. But then can the Quran be clear in its entirety? Allah said clear. Is it, is it completely by clear? It, no. By understanding so it, it's partially this verse, clear. Quran is clear. So Suraj, is, it, is it partially unclear. clear? And Allah said what? Well, the unclear ones who knows only Allah. Okay. The answer you have it. So, so you ask so, me another. Wait, wait. Okay. So the Quran is partially clear. I answered already. Okay. Quran has so two parts. What, what he said, the so Quran has two parts. The so clear part and an unclear part. No, no. So when the Quran is clear, it's only partially clear. I am finished and then I'm going to expose huh? these points. Sorry? Brother, it doesn't mean anything, so it's unclear. So effectively, if my house is clean, Sorry, and, and 10 rooms in my house are yeah, dirty, it's not, it's not clean. Please, it's a partially clean please, house. Please, so the Quran please. is a partially clear book. Go ahead. So now, I'm coming to the same point. He's diverting the topic, which is oh, no, no, the ask foundation the question. of Christianity. I, as That's I said, the foundation of Islam. If the root it doesn't work, it's wrong, the branches... And the Quran nothing. being clear is, is the root of Islam, Islam. Islam, it makes sense. One God, no Don't Father, make no, sense. no Son, no the Holy Spirit. But with two hands Again, and like a couple of eyes and the then point. like, you know, stays on his the throne, but the sense to hear to, to, to hear uh, uh, prayers. Waffling. According to wait, the book, wait, waffling. so Allah you does not have two hands. Listen, according to the Allah Bible... Allah doesn't have two right hands. According, according, yep. Wait, wait, wait. Yep, let me hear it. This guy, he doesn't read his Bible, Old Testament. Which part? The God of the Bible, yes. Old Testament, yep. has got body parts. So, shall I, shall here, here I is the great part. Topic. So, I will come to people that like Siraj yes. have to affirm like that every word that in the Quran like is it. literal. Christians However, in Christianity, God is we understand spirit. that the words that are in the, in the, in the, in the Bible the have different meanings. Some things are literal, some things are metaphorical. Literal, literal, literal. When we talk about yeah, God's hands or, or God's eyes yes, or God being our shield or God being our rock, these things are metaphorical because the Bible says categorically yes, that God is yes, spirit. Yes, However, Allah is not spirit. Allah has hands, you know, two literal two hands. hands. He's changing the topic, like, 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 the topic. I don't care about that. Bridget, one more, one more at okay. time, you know. So now, I'm no, saying, one person at the time. I'm saying according to Old Testament, God of the Bible, do you know who wrote the Ten Commandments? God, do you know what he used when he was writing? His finger. Metaphorical. His finger, uh, metaphorical. Uh, metaphorical. Uh -huh. Metaphorical. Uh -huh. Metaphorical. Uh -huh. Metaphorical. That's why Christianity yeah. makes more so, sense than Islam. So look, because if you follow Islam, again, you have to believe that again, Allah cannot hear your prayers again, unless he descends to the lowest heaven at night time. Topic. Changing the again, topic. Again, literal. I'm coming to the topic. I don't care about that. So here, he Makes said, no sense. Here he said, only God can be worshipped. Uh -huh. yes, I believe agreed. I'm coming to the triune God. Let's he hear said it. Let's only hear God it. can be worshipped. Let's yes? hear it. So according to him, yep. Jesus has two natures. Mm -hmm. And Jesus, the human and divine nature, must be worshipped. And all of us must worship. Can I start? Uh, can I have, can, sorry, sorry. I, I gotta yeah. go. Can you wait, please? Can you wait, please? Wait. Please? Thank you. Okay. Okay. So now... Why does Allah descend at night time? Why? I will answer that question. So he's asking why Allah in the night comes down to the fast. Why not in the day? In the, the evening. The answer is simple. Yep. Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam okay. is encouraging us to wake up in the night time to pray. So he lied? Uh, wait, wait. No, no, let him finish. I'm not lying. I'm okay. Not, no, no, no. He, he lied. No. Uh, 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 Muhammad lied. No, I'm telling you. Oh. oh. I'm telling him the reason Allah comes down to the fast heaven in the night. Seventh heaven, no? No, it's the fast heaven. I think I'm seven. teaching you the hadith. You're lying about the prophet. What, what's the number? I, 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 if, if, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. What's the number? I know the hadith in Arabic. I can read for you. Do you know what the number is? Okay, fine. Go, me, okay, yeah. I thought it was seventh. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. I know Allah comes to the first heaven. It's the hadith itself in the Arabic. It's not the seventh heaven. Yeah, it's here. It's here. 
Sayu Muslim hadith number Which is, 75 yep. 8 758 and the English says the English is here I'm telling you now the English, it says, the English is here Allah descends every night to the lowest heaven that's the it's seventh the one it's the first no it's no English no wait wait hold on hold on it's a star from the throne Come no down. that's the highest no this oh my is goodness the highest. He oh understand. yo yo okay okay all right this guy he doesn't understand so, Look, look, okay, let me explain it to you now. Okay, let me explain it to you now. Wait, wait, I'll so explain it to you. So, heaven is inverted in this No, 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 let me explain to you. Let me explain to you. If Allah is above his throne, yeah, yes. he comes down. This is seventh, sixth, fifth, fourth. And seventh is the Dunia. highest, and, and, and one is the lowest. is one, yes, in Arabic. Okay, lowest, yes. so he descends. So Allah comes oh, to wait, the first heaven. Wait, so you're, you're counting it from seven upwards and not one yes, down. It comes to the lowest. Lowest one means down. the last one. Okay, the last one. so, okay, okay, okay fine. Okay, now, I, I understand, understand what you mean. Effectively, okay. I was saying that he comes to now, the lowest confused, point in heaven. Yes. So me. I assume that heaven starts at, at no, one, then matter. two, then three, then four. Okay, if it's different, that's fine. What I meant was that he comes from the lowest point in heaven, yes. Okay, now. So he can't hear you from from level so now, seven, you have to get from level one. Okay, now let me come like to like the a building. No, let me answer to you now. Okay, question. go ahead. Okay, the reason Allah comes down to the first heaven in the night, mm -hmm. Prophet Sallallahu is encouraging yeah. us. Okay, Allah is yeah, encouraging us. Above the seventh, yeah. Above the seventh heaven. Well, okay. It says, it says both. Okay, that's fine. Wake up for the night prayer yep. and pray to him because that's the time Allah says, <laughs> who shall I shall forgive, shall ask me for forgiveness. Who shall ask me anything, I shall give. Yeah, that's the reason. So that hadith, nowhere in the hadith or in the Quran, Prophet Muhammad. Yeah, said it's, it's Allah not about all of the prayer. Yeah. The that's proof what, is that Allah. He said Allah cannot hear anything unless He comes to the first heaven. He cannot hear anything. According to the hadith, do you know Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? A lady came to him and said, "Ya Rasulullah." Look, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. A lady came to him and said, "Ya Rasulullah, O Messenger of Allah, my husband said." My husband said to me, I'm like his mother. I don't I'm, hear my do question being wait, answered. Wait, I'm answering that question according to this. The lady came to the Prophet and he, she said, Ya Rasulullah, O Messenger of Allah, my husband said, I'm like his mother, I'm like his mother, which means he cannot sleep with his wife. Then Prophet Aisha was just right there next to him, just right there to and or in front of I am just near to around Prophet Muhammad imagine guess what Aisha didn't hear what the lady said to the Prophet guess what Prophet said I do not know what to do with this matter yeah with this matter wait with this matter Prophet said I do not know what to do guess what Allah revealed a verse a co concerning about this matter and I should say imagine I was just right there yeah, in front but of Prophet can you hang out? I'll, I'll come back for what you. the lady okay. said you. but Allah had what Prophet said Allah had what the lady and Prophet were talking about above his throne At night time, so right? my question is here my question here he said Allah cannot hear anything unless what he comes it down descends. to the first heaven so my question to him if Allah no, cannot I, I wait, you, no, no, I'm no, coming. Wait. I asked you why. I'm coming. I asked I'm you answering. why does he have to descend here? So now I said he wasn't listening. You I haven't said anything. I, I repeat again? You haven't said anything of substance. Okay, You're I'll telling finish. me a story. I'll finish. So like, I if I ask you what's your okay, name, you're not gonna tell me a story. Wait, wait, wait. About my, my parents met in, in 1944. Can I finish? Can I Tell me the tell me actual reason. Oh. He said Allah cannot hear what anything. No, I said why does he have to descend to hear? Why? No, you said yourself Allah My cannot hear no, unless but he comes that's not a question. What, yeah, yeah, so why can't he hear? So, yeah. Oh, he said yeah, he why? can't hear. Yeah, no, what? Why oh. can Allah not hear your prayer unless he comes back down? Why? I'm answering. I'm finishing. Well, you're telling me a story. You're not asking I'm me a question. The story, I told you to this story, it says everything. Look here. The, a lady, I'll repeat again for you. Okay. A lady came to the prophet. No, 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 no. The end part, end part, end part. I, I got the story. Yes, she said something I shouldn't hear, but Allah had a good. Thank you. End part, end part, end part, end part. Go. I'll repeat for you now. Siraj, okay. you, you talk lady too much. Like, 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 look, I, I like you, but you talk oh. too much, Siraj. Oh, oh. Siraj, Siraj, can you learn? Just look, I, Siraj, anyone? do you see how I ask the questions? Okay. I ask I them straightforward. I don't tell you tall tales. Oh, Get to the end, please. Look, please. Look, I want to know. 
Okay. If you're not answer, if you're not listening, then I'm not going to. I heard you, Siraj. Okay, Don't listen. repeat it. Get to the end, okay, please. Okay. What did I say? If you heard me, Siraj. Okay, Siraj. What did I, I say? I just said what you said. I repeated what just now. What did I say? Repeat. Woman came to Allah. My husband sees me as his mother. No, wait, wait, wait. Uh, Allah. Uh, yes. um, sorry. Uh, Muhammad said I don't know what to do about this. Aisha heard it, but she didn't hear the full thing. But Allah heard it. Go. 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 What's the end? Aisha heard it, but not the full thing. No, but then I heard it. Go, no, go, 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 go. He just lied. He said, I Don't repeat the story, please, Siraj. Get to the end. I'm repeating. So now. Siraj, why do you talk okay. like an old man? Oh, like, why, why do you keep repeating the same okay. story okay. about Aisha? Get to the end, man. Okay, let me please, yeah, get, please. Okay. get to the end. Okay, for the sake of argument. Okay. No. Okay. This is frustrating. Okay, okay. If I told you the same story 18 okay. times, okay. you'd be angry at me. Okay, okay. Go. Okay. I, okay, I'm going to carry on from where I was, but he wasn't listening to all, but I'm going to say yes, it. Yes, yes, okay. carry on. I Aisha want to be the leader. was there. She said, I couldn't hear what the lady said. You're repeating yourself again, and Siraj. she said, Allah had from above. Siraj, I said this three times. Above his throne, he had what the lady was saying. So Allah, without coming to the first heaven, even if he is above the seventh heaven, the throne still can hear according to the hadith. And... Not every time Allah comes down to the first heaven. When we are praying Asr, Fajr, Maghrib, or other prayer times, always Allah hears us. Allah said Allah always hears us and He sees us. And Allah is with us according to His knowledge, not physically. So now I'm, I said, I refuted My that point. My question has yes, not been I, answered. I, already answered. I, I said, asked why I was given no Allah reason. Allah coming. Wait, wait. The what, do what do you want? This, this, this guy doesn't like you, man. Wait, is, is that the answer? I just said. I just answered. I just answered. Ooh! 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 Oh, snap. 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 Okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Anyways, it doesn't matter. All right, I'll come okay. out to you, man. Don't so worry now, about it. So now I'm asking, I'm asking, I'm asking where it says in that. It's, I only answered Prophet وسلم, what the lady said to him, Allah heard from above the seventh heaven, where Aisha was there, right to the trust Prophet. Trust me, he, he Christian, didn't trust hear me. anything. But Allah oh, but heard from he, above he, the seventh he, heaven. He. Allah. Even if he's not above the seven, uh, if he's not uh, on the first heaven, whether he's above the seventh heaven, still Allah hears us. And I said the reason Allah I can't comes believe I've let you talk this long, Siraj. Is encouraging us. That's when Allah, everyone sleeps, night prayer. That's where Allah is. When Allah so, says, okay. We shall so ask the answer is that Allah comes down to encourage you guys. Is, is that it? Yes. He's mercy. He's showing us His mercy. How merciful He is. How closer He, he is to us. Okay. That okay. Allah is now, to because us, it's then, always then nighttime practice. somewhere on the planet. Yeah. Does that mean that Allah is never on His throne, but is always down no, in the lowest heaven because it's nighttime day. somewhere? Now I'm asking now. It's nighttime so in Australia right now. Is it all over there? I already answered. You now tell me. You now tell me. Jesus Christ, man. Now you like, tell me. Th that was a horrible. To the Bible, Genesis. Hey, experience, experience. But let's go. Okay. According to Bible, Genesis. Genesis. Yep. Yeah, I'm ending. According Are you? to Bible. No. According okay, yeah, to Bible. I, I, okay, fine, fine. I, I get it. Okay, so Raj, make it good. No, no, wait. So Raj, Raj, Raj. Wait, Siraj, 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 can you, can you get, I get, no, get no, wait, 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 Siraj, 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 if this is the last one, Siraj, 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 if this is your last question, please bring me your strongest arguments against Christianity and then I'll answer, okay, the, the strongest one you have, you. that was it? You contradicted. Oh, that, that was trash, okay, fine, fine. Uh, Where you okay. said you worship so, God the Father, guys, the Son, guys, I, I, and the Holy I am Spirit. happy to carry on going as long as long as you want, but I think everyone's getting tired. So, Siraj, uh, one, one question at the end or, or what? Wait, wait. So now, see, huh? I'm talking about triune God. Okay, well, do you want start, triune look, God? Look, me, me and this guy talk a lot, so I have to no, problem. No, I answered your question. So now, okay. I said, well, you didn't according, know, to but, okay. according to Bible, according to Bible, you tell me when did Jesus claim divinity? What, at what age? Sorry? When, at what age did Jesus claim divinity? Oh, during his ministry. What age? So, in fact, like 30, I 30. guess. 30. Yep. Why not before 30? <laughs> Why not before 30? So, you see. I thought he knew you, that. Oh, okay. If you, if you read Matthew, right? No, no, I'm asking. You, answer my I'm question. I'm answering the question. Okay, I'm Hold up. I'm going to take like a long ass story. I'm just going to answer your way. Okay, I'm sorry. If you read Matthew, Matthew was written to the, uh, uh, the book of, of, of Matthew uh, was written to the Jews, okay? Uh -huh. this, is, this is basically explain why Jesus is the Messiah. 
what you will find is that everything that he did according to his 3M ministry perfectly lined up with, pre, with everything that he did in his 3M ministry from when he was 30 years old to 33 perfectly lines up with all the Old Testament scripture. So, the reason why he started at 30 and not 25 I'm or, not or, asking or ministry. Yes, you were. I'm not saying the ministry. The reason why he claims it then is because why, this is the time in which ministry. God has elected for him to begin his ministry. I said, uh, for example, I can ask, divinity. why didn't Muhammad become a, a prophet when, when no, he was 10? No, no, this guy is going See? wrong now. That's the answer. You get it wrong. Siraj, that's no, the no, answer. No, no, you get it wrong. So what that Old Testament scripture no, I'm could be fulfilled. Again, that's why. If Jesus knew the Old Testament... My answer before wait, he asked this question is Listen, that yeah? so He's that Old Testament scripture now. could be fulfilled. He's That's not making answer. any sense now. If Jesus knew the Old Testament before he started his ministry and he was priest and he knew everything, he knew the Old Testament, why would Jesus stop? He knew, if he knew that he was God from the birth when he born, why would Jesus stop him from claiming divinity. Why he waited until the age of 30? God of the Bible. And as I answered, God so that Old Testament scripture what could be fulfilled. Waiting? What was Jesus waiting? Until there were, if you read Why? Matthew, was Jesus there God are very the age of 12? specific things. Was Jesus God at the age of 12? Yes, Siraj, or no? hypostatic union. Was he Jesus was always with the divine nature and the human nature. So, God in order for certain things to line up God so the that they could be fulfilled, as in the course of the Old Testament, he started Jesus his ministry God at the age of 30. Age of if I ask you, did why Jesus didn't claim? Allah talk to Muhammad when he was 12 years old, no. you can't give me an answer. Okay. So, that question is completely no, no. logical. Okay, shall I answer that one? Okay. Logically, so, so okay. wait, wait. Let me answer. Why didn't Why didn't Allah come to Muhammad when he was 12 or yeah, 25 wait, yeah. or 30 or 39? Wait, yeah. Why when he was 40? Wait, yeah. There's no okay. reason. Okay. See. Listen. The difference is, prophets, they came prophets at a certain age. That we agree is fine. Prophet Moses, he didn't came. How prophet. old wait, was wait. Adam when wait, he was wait, a prophet? Wait, How old? Wait, wait, one. Wait, wait, wait. Adam was yes. not one. Who says wait. how old was you Adam? Tell me. How where, old where was he, he Adam, when he became a prophet? Wait, wait, how old was he? Wait, wait, wait. How old was he? Wait, I'm asking. Exactly. Wait, wait, wait. About an age. Prophet Moses. Age. Wait, prophets. It makes sense. They can become prophet at the age of 40, 30. Doesn't matter because Allah chosen that time. Why not to 25? A okay, okay. That one I answered. Allah can choose. But what I'm asking is, if Jesus was God before the world was created, listen here, yeah? logically. <laughs> According to him, Jesus existed before the world was created. That means Jesus, the man, knew that he was God incarnated into human. Yes, in every age, in sure. any age, at the age of 12, at the age of 7, at the, at the age of 20, Jesus, if he was God incarnated as a man, therefore, therefore Jesus could have known that he was God before he started his ministry. So my question to you, if Jesus knew he was God, before he started his ministry, why he didn't claim or say, said that I am God, or why he never claimed divinity the age of 12, if he knew that he was God and he, he incarnated as a man and he knew Old Testament, why he came to claim divinity at the age of 30. So there was, according to him, there was a time the God of Christians, Jesus, he was not God, he was walking around. At the age of 12, Jesus, who are you? I'm nothing. At the age of 15, Jesus, who are you? I'm nothing, I'm not God, not prophet. Okay. As fine. I said three times no now, prophet. so He's that Old He's Testament scripture would be fulfilled. Don't Empty forget, words. Jesus gathered his, his disciples. These disciples are the ones who then went and preached the gospel all across the world. These things, in order for them to be ready at the time to do these things, there had to be a, a certain timing that went, that went on with the revelation of Jesus Christ as God. Don't forget, Jesus Christ did many things in, in, in his life, during his ministry. No, and all, all those things were did. time specific. Why. Okay, so God, that Jesus is why he was God. you gave me a reason why prophets he he have to told. wait till they're 30 he years old not. before they become God. prophets. But I asked you a question. Why wasn't Muhammad a prophet at 25? It makes sense, Jesus. Why wasn't he? No, I accept. See? No, your question accept is pointless. Jesus was a prophet. No, I accept Jesus was a prophet at the age of 30. It's fine. Because he never, God never chose him. That is the beginning of his ministry. No, wait. God never chosen him at that time. Hold he on a second. In Islam, you believe that he was miraculously born. 
So you're telling me that God causes somebody to be born miraculously but doesn't choose them to be a prophet? That's a lie. What do you mean? Say okay, okay. You're telling me that God chose somebody to be born miraculously, right? But waited until he was 30 before he became a prophet. Meanwhile, in the cradle, according, according to you, in the cradle, he was talking and saying that he was a prophet. Now, his logic, he's comparing. Look, look. He's not making any Guys, sense. Guys, wait. He wait, said wait, that wait, Jesus yeah. waited wait, to be a prophet, wait, but he believed okay, wait, that he wait, was born a prophet. Wait, 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 wait. Miraculously. Wait, wait, wait. wait listen wait, here. Listen. Yeah. Listen it's here. It's the same piece of your okay, there. I'm coming to you. What is this? His weak logic. Really? He's comparing yes? prophets and God. Can we compare prophets and God? No, I am not. No, I am you, comparing no, the I'm ministry, ask, asking, the ministry of no, Jesus. I'm asking simple questions. That's what I'm comparing. Can I compare God and prophet? No, you can't. No, I can't. So Jesus in Islam, we make sense. We believe he's a prophet. He became a prophet. Uh, uh, when? 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 From birth. But you just said he became one at 30. You, you just no, said that. According to you. You said we believe. Come on, you, according okay, to you. Everyone, re reverse this, okay? Yeah, he fight. said no, he said we believe yeah. that he became a prophet at 30. Yeah, look, he's just twisting the who's, verse. Who's we? Are you, no. are you, are you a Christian? No, no you're a Muslim. Twisting the verse. He twisting the verse. Now. He said we. Oh, this is he a Christian? Twisting the verse. No, no he's not. He's twisting the verse. I said, according to him, Jesus became a prophet. And okay, he started his maybe ministry maybe you misspoke. At the age of thirty. Maybe so you now misspoke. I'm asking, did Jesus knew that he was God at the age of twelve? Yes or no? Jesus. Yes or no? So Jesus. Yes or no? Is always divine. He, no. He is. He no. is. He is. No, no, he is two natures question. in one no, person. No, answer. I, I don't so want that. Yes. One. Did Jesus yes, knew? he will okay, always yes, have known because the yes. divine nature always yes, no. always knows. Now he said Jesus knew he was God at the age of 12. The divine I nature will always know. How come Jesus never claimed God at the age of 12 than if he knew he was God? Did he have the disciples to answer, write down what he said at 12? Answer, answer, answer Did that he question. have disciples to write down what he said at the age of 12? The divine Why nature is always aware that he is God. But the human nature might come into okay. that knowledge as, as he grows older. Why? But the divine nature is always aware. Why he never claimed God? Huh? Why he never claimed God? We don't have many writings of See? him when he was 12 years oh. old, right? But, but ultimately, the, 30, the divine nature will always what? know. Yes, yes. So in the same and way, I asked you, why and wasn't Muhammad what? a prophet at 25? You know why? No, I said you compared God and prophet. So you what? Why can't God. I compare this? No. Essentially, you you're asking me why does God, God wait for a certain amount of prophet time before he does God. something? So I'm telling you the same thing applies in Islam. God okay. waits before he does certain okay. things. And if you ask why I God waits that long, for, okay, for example, why did God take six periods to make creation? Why not four? Why not two? Can you answer why God waits to do certain things? Listen, I just That's your question. No. And it's, look, it's, it's pointless. Okay, it's pointless. Now again, I'm repeating. God of the Bible, when did he claim divinity? God the Father, when did he claim divinity? Before the world was created. Wait, God of But Jesus, wait, there, wait. he waited how, until the How does God the Father Jesus, claim divinity before there's a world? God was God before the world yeah, was created. Yeah, but how does he claim it but before Jesus, the world? No, listen now. Doesn't make sense. Oh, Siraj, logic. man. I like look, your energy, but like, prophets, you need to like tighten up your arguments a bit more. Look, it's not making any sense. Prophets, prophets, he's comparing prophets and God. God was always there. God the Father claimed divinity before the world was created. But how? To who? Listen, listen. To who? Before Jesus was created from his mom. Before Jesus was created, God oh, the Father Siraj, claimed Siraj. God. But Jesus, okay, the difference so between, Siraj wait, 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 wait. has been talking for too long. The difference between God the Father and Jesus. So I'm going to ask a question Jesus now. God at the so Siraj, party, but my God question now. Siraj, I have a question for you. Which is the best one for you? Siraj, um, the, the Isra Mirage, is that a, a, a physical thing or a dream? Yeah, I'm going to the time. What's Siraj, the, the Isra Mirage, right? Yeah. When Angel Gabriel opens up Muhammad's roof and then like, like gives him a horse and they fly away into heaven, is that, right? Is that is, something is, to do is, with is, the is root of Israel? Yeah, yeah. It, it, or are you it talking is, about branches? It, no, no, listen, listen, listen. No. So that's the root, no. right? Because no, in, the in, the root. in the narrative, it is believed that Muhammad led listen. a prayer in front of all the prophets, cementing himself as the seal of the prophets. Was yeah. that a dream or a physical event? <laughs> I need to know. Physical. Okay, okay, great, great, great. Muhammad says that he flew to, uh, supposedly to, uh, to Jerusalem and he attended a masjid in Jerusalem in the year 627. There was no masjid in Jerusalem in the year 627 because there were no Muslims in Jerusalem at the time. 
So therefore, he's, he's lying. Oh, he's according lying. To according to him, he's lying. Islam, Islam is often a historical. historical. No, oh, he's History says one thing, oh, Islam says one other oh, thing. Historical. And for some reason, I'm meant to believe Islam over actual evidence no, in history. No, brother, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Wait, wait. He's huh? the topic, jumping so Islam like says one thing, history says one, like one thing, now. but for some reason I'm supposed just to believe listen. Islam over history. Just listen. Whatever, man. Just listen. This guy is silly logic. History, according history. to scientists, history, according history, to him. History. Now, wait, wait, wait. Ask any wait, wait. Okay, wait, find can I any speak? Jew. Can find I any speak? Jew. Can I Ask speak? them if in the year 627 there was a match in Jerusalem. Can Ask I them. Can I speak? Everyone listen here. Everyone listen here. Hey, but it's Siraj is speaking. Going, Listen to him. He's going to logic, yeah, yeah? and history. Okay, Siraj, I, I, I don't know. What, what do you want to do? End or uh, I, 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 what, what do you want to do? What's it? Another, another question. No, yeah. It's what, what, what do you want to do? Shall I come back? Huh? Shall you, you want to come? Do you, back? Do you guys want one more, one more, more of us, or do you get what? Uh, next week, or what do you guys want? Make it about Islam next. Huh? Salat, salat. Okay, fine. Okay. So let me answer the last question, and I'm going. But you answered already. About the Jerusalem. Okay, history, fine. About Go ahead. History. So, so wait, wait. Okay. in the year 627, okay. if the Isra Mirage was a okay. physical event, mm -hmm. how would Muhammad go to Jerusalem and then lead a prayer? Uh -huh. If there was no masjid in Jerusalem in the year 625, oh, sorry, okay. 27. 27. Go ahead. So now basically he's going to history. Christians, they play two cards. When they want, they go to Bible. When the Bible doesn't suit them. Oh, history. sorry, sorry. I should read. Come out. <laughs> history, come out. Guess what? When the history doesn't suit them, Bible. Science, when it doesn't suit them, Bible. Lies. When Bible doesn't suit them, when the Bible doesn't suit them, science. When they want to refute Quran, science. When they guess what? Logic now. The Bible isn't a historical. Wait, wait here. Uh, like the Quran. Wait here. Now, if I disprove him just Go by ahead. using science, he no believes, history. History is fine. He believes. Okay, history. Yes, even logically. Now he believes. When Jesus died on the false crucifixion, guess what happened? All the dead people in Jerusalem came out from the grave and so, started So, Sarah just didn't answer my question. That one in history, who believes that? Who approves? So, no Sarah evidence. Sarah just didn't answer my no question. Evidence. Show me that There's evidence. no evidence Same for Muhammad what, what, even what, being a prophet. What, what, There's no what, evidence what, for the moon splitting. Also, There's so, no evidence. See, see. So, see, where's, the evidence? where's the evidence used? Where's the so evidence, evidence that in the sixth century, the moon, a giant celestial yes, body that more two approved. people can see, wouldn't have, and that nobody anywhere in the approved. world saw it that and recorded it? Science approved. So now science you tell me, has said so nothing now you tell about me. a giant split in the Listen, entire middle of the moon. Where's the history evidence that when Jesus died on the fourth crucifixion, the dead people arose? Where's the evidence? From the where's the evidence that Muhammad saw the moon half? Where's the evidence? And walked on the Jerusalem, Jerusalem Road Street. Show me the, where's evidence? the evidence. Show me so the evidence me. that My in the six hundreds, in the seventh century, so somebody cut the moon in okay. half, and nobody science anywhere on the planet saw it. Science approved there that is one. no science, science that says that anything about okay, the moon getting cut in half. So now again, I want evidence. It and I want Prophet evidence of the moon. Elijah. Go ahead. Now I want evidence. Prophet Elijah in the Bible. Do you know he was dead? Do you know what? He was dead. And his bones? Guess what? He was dead. He was buried. And guess what? A dead person, they put a dead person into his bone. They thrown the dead person to the bones they of They buried someone Elisha. next to his bones. And then Elisha's bones, do you know what happened? Because of Elisha's bones, that dead person touched the bones of Elisha. And came as life. And then the person came alive. Oh. Where's the evidence? Oh, sorry? What's this? Yes, it's seven oh seven five. I mean, my history yeah. is Quran um, and so Hadith. If, if, if you guys would like, uh, very this briefly, um, according my to the first masjid that was built in Jerusalem, Quran. the mosque is, is, is the second oldest in the world after the Kaaba and the Mecca. Where? Although Wikipedia. Muslim tradition dates, I'll ask back to this Isaac's son, website. Jacob, the Wikipedia. mosque was first built yeah, at its Wikipedia. present location yeah. at the, uh, by the Wikipedia. Umayyad Caliphate uh, uh, by Al-Malik and his son Al-Walid and completed in the year Wikipedia. 705. Show me. No, six Show me. no, 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 I want to get what website. Al-Aqsa Mosque, Travel Jerusalem. Yeah. Okay, what are you saying? So what are you, this one does not approve your point. It does, because this is, this is the second mosque, the second oldest mosque in the entire no, world. No, no, no. Look here, yeah. let me show please. Let me show uh, the camera. Watch what, out. What, 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 I'm uh, exposing him, watch out. Wikipedia. Oh my God. Wikipedia. Seven, so Wikipedia. What year? What year? Wikipedia. 705. So if Muhammad went, so unless Muhammad traveled into the future, 
So, wait, uh, 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 Siraj, do you believe that in the Israel Mirage, Muhammad went into the future as well? Do you believe that? No, sources. Huh? Wikipedia. Who uploads Wikipedia, Wikipedia here? Oh, I can right, write. right. So what you're saying is that Wikipedia is anti-Islam, so that's why they've done it. Yep, sorry. Christian website. Wikipedia. Wikipedia. History, right there. History, oh, history. Where's the history in the way it says Jerusalem dead people of Jerusalem came out from the graves and they walked on the road of Jerusalem. I'll show you that no when you show me the, the, the evidence that so Muhammad stood the moon in half. doesn't have evidence. My evidence and is there's no hadith. evidence to suggest My that Muhammad ever stood the moon in half. Hadith. Your evidence is the Bible. So you use your Bible and I use my Quran. You can't tell me I cannot use my the Quran. The Quran and Hadith, hadith will send you down a, a very confusing Guess path what? in life, man. He believes. Now I'm asking last question. I'm going here. For example, the, 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 there's a, a story in the Hadith where last somebody asked Muhammad, what does the devil last look question. like? And Muhammad said that the, 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 he pointed to a tall, a tall black man with long hair, no, with a sturdy words, build. And he words. said that, the, that, that if you want to see the devil, liar. look at Nabtal. Okay. He looks like a devil. He's a, he's a tall, strong, sturdy liar, black man liar. with long hair. He's lying. So according he's to Muhammad, I show me. might look like Come, a devil. Show me. Huh? Show me the Hadith. Sure thing. Watch out, yeah? Sure thing. What did he say about Prophet? Watch out. So, wait. No, no, wait. show me the reference. No, listen. Reference. So, no, before no, I show no, it to you, no. let reference. me repeat what I said. Reference. The prophet was asked, what did he the say? prophet was asked, Listen. what does the devil look like? Uh -huh. Listen, yeah. He pointed at Naptal, uh -huh. a tall, sturdy black man with long hair, uh -huh. and said, if you see Naptal, uh -huh. you've seen the devil. Okay, listen, yeah. Listen, yeah, the hadith, the sources tell me, watch out this guy, yeah. I'm sure 100% he's lying. We heard this argument. Yeah, he's lying. Liar, liar. Don't go Pants on. Liar, liar, liar. Watch okay. out this guy right. here. He wants to teach me the Quran and the Hadith when I'm teaching Quran and the Hadith and his Bible. Watch out. You don't guy. know anything about the Bible. Um, Listen, he said Alpha and Omega is Jesus who claimed it. Do you know who claimed it? Yeah. Alpha and Omega is a sheep with seven heads and seven eyes, seven horns and seven no, eyes. No, no, no. You, 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 wait, well, you, you, bring, you no, mix you three no, things no, together. No, bring, bring, the bring. sheep does not have no, seven bring. heads and horns. Wait, that is the dragon, the beast. That I, out, yeah. You've gotten them confused. Out, yeah. You've gotten them confused. Out. Okay, wait, okay. All right. no, show me the Here's what we'll do. To no. end this, right? No, I'll, I'll, I'll bring my hadith, I'll and hadith. I need Surah to bring the, the revelations uh, yeah, uh, go, the verse about the sheep having seven horns. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Revelation um, 5 6, Revelation 17 14, Revelation 5 13. It says, John said, I have seen a sheep uh, with seven heads, seven uh, and horns, and seven eyes. And he said, They represent the seven spirits of God, and which God is spread into all the earth. Yeah? And you know what he says? They will, people will wage war against the sheep. What sheep? With seven horns and seven eyes my question to you, them is jesus a sheep with seven heads seven horns and seven eyes the answer is no so no, you know what the sheep said that is heavenly imagery you know what, the, what the sheep said uh, the lord of lord the lord of lords the king of kings so is jesus seven and uh, a sheep with seven horns with seven eyes christians if they say jesus is a sheep they lie yeah, done, done. <laughs> revelation chapter 17 verse 14 is the one who said i'm alpha and omega it's not jesus Which and i said a dead this? person cannot be omega and someone had a beginning cannot be alpha jesus before 12, the age of 30 he was not god he had nothing he was given any nothing no authority even after he became a prophet jesus according to the bible he's a false prophet forget about being god you know what Jesus said? All right, I am unable to find the actual reference, right? Hey, hey, However, hey, hey, don't no worry, reference. don't worry, you can all look it up. No so, reference. Ibn Ishaq like said, Ibn Ishaq, uh, Ibn Ishaq oh. said, Naptal was a stocky no man reference. with unkempt hair reference. and his head. Reference, where, no uh, reference. Wait, where is it? No uh, reference. Oh, anyway, uh, no reference. find it for yourself. No um, Ibn Ishaq said, no Naptal reference. was a stocky man with unkempt no hair reference. and on his head no and reference. his beard was unkempt too. Where's reference? He, what? Where's reference? Oh, what, what? Expanding his eyes. Oh, where's the, what, where's what? the thing? Revelation online. That, okay, that isn't the one. Revelation. Um, oh, no, no. No, no. wait a second. Oh, oh, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. He go exposed. No worries. Revelation <laughs> chapter 17, verse 14. Revelation chapter 5, verse 6 is not Says Jesus. what? He's speaking yeah, Alpha and Omega. He's a sheep with seven horns, with seven eyes. Does Jesus, is Jesus a sheep with seven horns? With seven eyes? No. Since when? 
That, oh, oh, sorry, sorry, it's not, it's not most that, sorry. That is heavenly imagery. That is not what just literally is. He had a vision, yes, because within the Bible, we allow for there to be interpretation. Whereas the Salafis have to uh, take everything literally. We don't believe that literally Jesus is a sheep with seven horns and seven eyes. Oh, by the way, I don't even think it says horns and eyes. Yes, bring it up. Bring it up. I'm teaching you a book. Bring it up. But effectively, that is heavenly imagery. Go ahead, bring it up. Chapter 5, verse 6. Here. That's on literally it's heavenly. Listen here. Listen here. Here. Revelation chapter 5 verse 6. It says then I saw a lamb looking as if it had been slain standing at the center of the throne encircled by the four living creatures and the elders. The lamb had seven horns. Seven horns. You said it doesn't say that. Seven horns and seven eyes yeah. which are okay. the seven Man, right. spirits of god i'm teaching your book you can't teach me mine i exposed you by giving me hold on a second reference you i didn't give you a false will reference go to hell. i will find it for you Revelation. oh fine you're right about yes. that According however Bible, that does not mean by any sense hell. that the, uh, that jesus the Bible, is the literal he, lamb with literal seven horns because don't forget Bible, it says that the Bible, lamb Revelation like he was slain is jesus is not a slain lamb speak, with seven horns and seven eyes speak again go ahead according to the revelation same book Christians are lying. They said Jesus said I'm Alpha and Omega. Yes, he did. It's not Jesus speaking. Who, who is? I said, who is? The sheep. Who is? It's the sheep speaking. The sheep Same represents dude. Jesus. So, okay, wait, wait. Okay, wait, wait, wait. That's an even bigger problem. Uh, so now he's saying that a sheep Jesus. can be Alpha and Omega. So wait, so in, 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 in that case, the hey, Jesus. it's a lamb, not a sheep. No. Okay, so okay. in that case, Siraj, explain to me is why Jesus. a lamb is Alpha and Omega and Alpha and Omega. No, 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 no. Why is a lamb sheep, and Alpha and Alpha Omega? Explain to me. I'm asking, is Jesus So that means you're saying that it's a lamb as the Alpha and Omega. Is so Jesus. my question to you is, I'm why asking, is a lamb I'm and Allah both called Alpha and Omega? Explain that part. Exactly. Is Jesus a sheep? With seven horn, with and seven. With that seven is simply eyes. heavenly answer, imagery. Answer. That is heavenly it's imagery. No imagery. He said, God is a spirit. Yes, he is not need... literally a wait, slain wait, lamb. Wait. That makes oh, no sense. Listen. So in that case, now if if, if you're saying yeah, that's if you're that's saying that's what okay. it is, explain to me to why supposedly a slain lamb is Look called Alpha and Omega. He said, I saw a lamb. So is that a vision? I noticed that we know Siraj English. likes to repeat himself over and over that, and over again. Is that a vision? He saw, yes, a vision, again, absolutely. When you Bible, see heavenly Jesus things, it's impossible for you as a human being to see those things in their full glory. Listen, so it looks forget, to him like a lamb, but there is nowhere that God. Jesus is the actual, is the actual forget, lamb. Forget Jesus to be God. Jesus disqualified to be a prophet according to the Bible. Shall giving I give me the shack, evidence? Two, two, four, help three, him, giving help him. Sure, I'll take help. Look here. I have, yep. I have heard. Okay, so you have you have um, Ibn Ashak. Ibn Ashak two four three. So two, four, three. I heard. Yeah. Two four three. Uh, no, no. Up, up here. Up here. Where? So no, 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 no. I heard. I go the book. I heard. I heard the apostle say. Okay, listen. Whoever wants to see Satan, listen here. Look at Naphtal. Listen here. He was a sturdy black man False. with long flowing hair. False references. Hair. False references. So apparently, listen. if Muhammad saw me today, he'd be like, "Yo, look at David. Listen That's here. the devil, man." Listen. According to Ibn Ishaq. Two, four, three. Oh, Thanks for the help. Appreciate references. it. References. There we go. False, false references. Says, false Come on. References. Yep. Go ahead. He said, go the ahead. website. Why is the website green? Wait. No, no, no. No, no, no. It, it, it was Cora. No, no, no. It was Cora. No, no. It was Cora. So go. Where? Where's the website? It was, it was Cora. Cora. So, yeah. Where? So, go, go, go find Ibn Ashad 243. No, where's the website? Break. Come here. Why are you running? Why are you running? He's running. Move, move, move. He's running. What the frick, man? He's running. Sorry about that. So now, so, Ibn Ashraq 243 says that. So, I'm can you explain to me, Siraj, okay. why for some reason okay. Muhammad I'm thinks that uh, the Satan looks like a black man? Listen here. Listen here. I'm exposing. Go ahead. He quoted Ibn Ashraq 243. Reference. No, Ibn Ashraq. You wrote the reference. You know who wrote it? It's Quora. It's Quora. No, no, no. Wait, Quora wait, is a, is, is, is wait, a website where you can liar, go liar. and find answers. No, oh, Quora, Quora didn't write it. It's, it's still put Islam. on Quora. No. It's Quora about Islamic no. sources. It's no. about everything. I'm asking. Everything. It's Quora about Islamic sources. It's about everything. Okay, in Quora. If oh, wait, wait, wait. 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 So the only way, okay. so the only way that I can understand anything gay, about Islam is if I only use my Islamic sources. If I don't, in Quora, Jesus is a gay, would you believe it? Sorry? 
Quora it says Jesus is a gay. Shall that I show does you? not support is that real? anything is that that's real? in the Bible. Answer, answer. So did Ibn Ishaq write that or gay? not? No, answer. I told you. Quora saying that. Quora wait, reference. hold on a second. I thought you couldn't it's stop Quora Quora us. Reference. No. I thought you couldn't stop us. Again, it's when Again, you say I'm going to Ibn Ishaq. I know Even the said, I heard the apostle Listen, say yeah. that if you want to see Satan, Korra, yes. look at Napta. Where is the website? It was Korra, Korra. Yes, but do. effectively, Korra is the website look where Raya. you can write things, you see, essentially. Is that how you so talk? effectively, if you want you to talk, know man? for sure, you look up even the shark 243. Go, go ahead. Go ahead. Korra says Jesus is a gay. Come here. You real. Go ahead. Look it up. Watch out. Yeah. Even the shark 243. Look it up. 243. He got the reference from Korra. I did. Watch out the way I'm going to expose you. Can you believe that uh, information is on the internet? Wait here, wait here, here, watch out. I know Go what it ahead. says. Watch out here. So what's it saying? Watch out. All right. And guess what? Prophet is the one who we're, said. We're still going. Prophet is the one who said. The apostle. No superiority. By the way, that's Arab a weak hadith. Over black. That's a weak hadith. Listen. That, that, that isn't listen, sahih. Listen. If it ain't sahih, I don't want to hear listen, it. That, that ain't sahih. sahih. Put it up. Sahih. Put it up. It's sahih. No, sahih. More than sahih. one hadith. More sahih. than one hadith. If it ain't sahih, sahih, I don't want to hear it. Yes, it's sahih. Put it up. More than one hadith. Show me sahih. No, now, show me. Go on sunnah.com and show me sahih. That's not sahih, it's a lie. Oh, and by the way, so the prophet supposedly said, right? So the prophet said that there's no difference between a black man, a white man, and an Arab. What about Indians? What about the Japanese? What, what, what about the Inuits? What about Latinos? So wait, so wait. So according to our prophets, wait, wait, there's wait, wait. only Arabs, wait, wait, white people, him. and black people. What about everybody else? Wait, wait, wait. Now, what about everybody else? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Huh? Wait, wait, wait. What about Somalians? I'm giving him Quran. Yeah. I'm giving you Quran. Let me hear it. I give him Hadith. Let me hear it. Let me hear it. Can I express to you? Uh -huh. Can I explain to you? Mommy forgot everybody else. Wait, wait, wait. All he saw was white wait, dudes wait, and black dudes and Arabs. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no Japanese, wait, wait. no Let Inuits, no Metal Americans, no Indians, Shoot. no Latinos. Oh, Lord. You want me to speak? Go ahead. Shall I speak? Go ahead. Quran. 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 Why you Quran. Why does Allah have two hands that are both right? Why doesn't Allah have a left hand? He's a liar. Let me know. Let me know. Why doesn't Allah have a left hand? Please wait. Please wait. Why Left hand. Hand. Let me hear it. Let me hear it. On the right side. Huh? Listen, wait, wait, wait. According to the Bible, I give him God is the one who wrote the Ten Commandments yes, he did. by his fingers. Yes. His finger wrote yes. it. Yes. Christians are the only one to believe God is a spirit in the Bible, Old Testament. Mm -hmm. There is nowhere a single verse mm -hmm. where it says God of the Bible, God the Father in Old Testament is a spirit. Nowhere. You know what God of the Bible said? Let us make man it in It talks about a lot of spirits. Image. David said, There's cast God me not away from your presence, O Lord, and okay. take your Holy Spirit How from me. So the Spirit is mentioned image? a lot. How can the Spirit have an image? Okay, so yes. great. Perfect. So, so for some, for some reason, huh? go for it. Go for it. For some it's, reason, Muslims believe, right, that because God uh, made us in his own image, right, that means Mr. that God Liar. literally looks Mr. like 243, 243, so the, 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 243, 243, so because, just simply because wait, wait, it says wait, wait, in the Bible wait, wait. that God you. made man in his own he, image, he, for he, some he reason, Siraj over here believes he that got that means that God from, made man in, the, in the image that he looks like, that is not what he believes uh, at all, we believe that we're made in the image of in the same way that we have emotion, we have nationality, we can discern right from wrong, that is how we are in the image of God, Let me not the way we look. Conversely, in the Hadith, it says that Let Allah made, made man in his likeness. Look, so what does no, that mean? No, it doesn't say that. Yeah, it does. No, it doesn't yeah, say it that. Does. No, he's lying. Yeah, Again. it does. No, he's lying. If, so even, now, even, in the hadith, listen, even in the Hadith. Allah said in the Quran, yeah. I'm exposing his lies. Wait, wait, wait. Well, he, wait, he, brother, he believes that it is. Brother, I'm exposing his lies. Now, I'm going to pray now. Is it now? Yes? Yeah, I'm going to pray. So last one, he said, Prophet Muhammad, he lied about Koro. He quoted a reference as Koro, yes? Ibn Ishaq, yes? 240, 240. Yeah, I'll come at you. I'll come at you. Yeah? Okay, watch out. Prophet Allah said in the Quran, chapter 49, verse 13, Allah said, listen, black, white, brown, Asians, African. Where did he say Africans? Wait, wait, wait. 
Wait, where did you see Africans? I'm going to show you. The, the word Africa wasn't even used then. No, no, wait, 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 wait. It wasn't. Wait, wait, wait. It's not true. It's they used as no, 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 Not to refer to the entire continent. No, black. Black, no, black. In the 6th century. Brother, wait. In the 6th century. Brother, you interrupted me. You interrupted me. Not Africa as a whole. Brother, interrupted me, please. Wait. Okay. And Sam, Sam, please wait, listen. Sam, hey, man. Now I'm going to explain. Bad boy, I thank you. Allah said in chapter 49, verse 13, Allah said, Ya ayyuhan nasu inna khalaqnaakum min dhikrin wa usha. Oh boy. Oh mankind. Who are the mankind? What about the Indians? Wait, can I finish? Stop talking like a child, man. What about the Indians, man? Listen, I'm talking now. Stop talking like an old man. You repeat yourself too much. Go ahead. Go for it. Allah said in the Quran, chapter 49, verse 13, Allah said, Actually, the Romans were there, so they were white, so that's just lie. We have created you from a single male and a single female. They, well, okay, that's and we to the Europeans, but they were around, don't worry. Don't worry, they were around. And tribes, little Arab who say you yeah, may Arab know tribes. one another. Wait. Arab tribes. This guy is crazy, man. Allah said, oh, I ain't crazy. Mankind. I have created you, mankind. Is mankind Arab only? No, wait. But What's then mankind? why? Why is mankind? Why did Muhammad you know only address the blacks, whites, you know and Arabs? English. Why didn't he say, you know oh, English. mankind? There's you no said, difference. Exactly. Okay, See, again, that's the problem. Hadith. Allah said, oh mankind, mankind is not just Arab, mankind... So why didn't Muhammad say mankind? I'm I'm why did he only say Arabs like a wife? Exactly, finish. there you go. Let me finish, you're lying. <laughs> Allah said, oh mankind, we have created you from a single male and female. And we have made you nations and tribes. And Allah said, inna akramakum Allah The best one amongst you is the one who fears Allah. You never said the best one is Arab, the best one is black, the best one is uh, white. And Hadith in the Prophets, do you know what he said? Adam. Allah said, Prophet said, people are from Adam. And he said, Allahu Adam And Allah has created Adam from clay. And he said, people are two types. He said, one is Barun. Hey, and Karimun and Allah. What does that, that mean? So kind, kind and generous and, and kind. Who are they? Allah. Wait. The Arabs? No, Arabs. No, he's explaining. Okay. He said the best one, Prophet Sallallahu he said, is the one who fears Allah and he's kind towards Allah. And he's a good person towards Allah. And the other one, and the, the other one, Prophet said, Fajr is and Allah. And Allah. Is the other one is okay? Okay, I'm coming. Okay, he said, Fajr. The one, the other one is a criminal person, and he's unlucky person towards Allah. People are two types. He never said Arab, and Prophet said what? There's no superiority Arab over black. Black over white, white over black. Except, 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 except by the by the uh, being be, be pious. Just the, so effectively, pious, what that is saying pious. is that it is possible for you mankind. to be better and than an Arab or an Arab to be better than a black person in Muslim. terms of piety, Last but it does not include Muslim. any people Muslim. from Japanese, anybody Muslim. who's Indian, anybody who's Allah Muslim. said mankind. Also, mankind included Chinese, but Muhammad didn't Chinese. say that. That's Prophet my problem. Muhammad didn't say mankind. Oh, Huh? Okay, so everybody, to end this, I will, I will put one final hadith. Sahih Muslim 2612E. When anyone fights his brother, he should avoid hitting his face. For Allah created Adam in his own image. Hey, listen now. Again, misquoting the hadith. Wait, but why listen, should I avoid hitting his listen, face? Listen, misquoting the hadith. Because for some reason, if, if, if Allah listen, made him in his image, listen, why should I avoid his face? He's lying. Yeah. He doesn't know Arabic grammar. I don't. He said, I listen, know will. I will leave the Arabic here. Read it. Let him hear it. Mm. That's listen right. Now. That's right. Listen now. Yep. I'm going to expose him. Expose me. He doesn't know Arabic. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> Listen, that, that, that's not sort of lie, I don't know. He it. doesn't know Arabic uh -huh. and Arabic grammar. Yep. Yeah, it yep. says, yep. Allah, Allah okay. has Khalaqa Adam, uh -huh. has created Khalaqa. Adam. Yes. Okay? Uh -huh. Listen, grammar, I'm teaching him. I'm hearing it, I'm hearing it. Surety, right. His image does not go back to Allah, but okay. to Adam. Right. It's going right. back to Adam. So, Do you know why? Wait, wait. The hadith says, wait, I wait. should not hit my liar. brother liar, in the face liar. because Adam was wait, made wait, 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 in wait. his own image. Adam is image. What does Adam be made in his image, image. No, have to do Adam's with me image. hitting my brother in the face? Listen. Yeah.
is Adam's image. So because what's the tafsir of the verse? Arab. I'm teaching Arabic. No, but I'm what's the tafsir? Because Listen, if you're claiming Listen. that Adam was made Listen. in the image of Adam, how yeah. does that make any sense? We we act as, as an adult. Can I make act as Can an I make the color red? You don't in know the Arabic. Arabic. Color red? You don't know Arabic. No, but it makes you no sense. English. It makes you no don't sense, understand. right? It makes for sense. Example, you don't know for example, for example, if someone says that I made something in my image, right? That would mean that there had to be a reference for me to use to make that thing. So Allah used some kind of reference Last to one. make Adam Last and that one. reference is him. Okay, can I speak? Have you done? Can I speak? Okay. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. He's being smart, yes? In Very Arabic, smart. In Arabic, in Arabic, yes. the context always, yes. It goes with the, the last person or the last action was mentioned, the last one, not before. So, so now what do you mean? I'm just explaining to you. Wait. Okay. Wait. Allah, the verse, uh, the hadith says, Allah created Adam in his image. It means the Adam's image. The, this How can you can create something oh. in the image of something that doesn't exist? Oh, wait, so wait, before wait, Adam wait. existed, how could wait, Allah wait, have a reference wait, wait. to make Adam from because if Allah Adam didn't exist? A, Allah knew how Adam was going to look like. Allah is knowledgeable. Allah knew how was so Adam So then it should just say that look. Allah made Adam Allah, full stop. Allah it shouldn't say in his own image. Listen, Effectively, what's listen, happened here listen, is that this, this is copied guy, from the Bible. But unfortunately, like whoever copied this has no this idea guy, what it means he to be know made Arabic in the image of even. God. That's why they're having this problem. Do you know Arabic? Huh? Do you know Arabic? Okay. Do you know I don't Arabic? need to know Arabic. Do you know Arabic? Do you know Arabic? Can I phone? Just last one. Can I phone? Okay, wait. Can I wait. Yeah. I'm explaining last one. Allah yeah. said, the hadith says. Okay, wait. It's late already. Yeah. What's the time? It's past. We can make the time go. Okay, go just the one minute. Uh, yeah, just, one just, minute. This is not worth it. I'm done. It's one minute. Uh, one minute. Uh, one minute. I'm done. One minute. But, but you're meant to do dawah, right? One minute. You're meant to tell the world about Allah, right? So that's what he's doing. He's telling the world about Allah on his two right hands. One minute. I'm going to. And and him making Adam in an image of Adam somehow. Yeah. Conclusion. Okay. Basically, he's trying to misuse the hadith. He's no, it yeah, would no. make sense. I'm going to conclude. I'm going. I'm, yeah. I'm concluding. You're going? I'm going. Yeah, I'm okay, going. fine. I'm going to pray. In that case, all right. Okay. So, Siraj so is going to pray. Wait, 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 this wait, wait, was a great wait, conversation. Siraj so has a lot of energy. But his only problem is he doesn't have a good understanding no, 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 of Christianity and Christian now, principles. He's going to pray. That's know. fine. No. We can have a conclusion no, next time. No, 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 He's kind of sweating a little bit. You Effectively, lose. what I will say is Siraj does not understand anything to do with Christian theology. And that's, that's his own problem. He's very well studied in, in the ways of Islam, but I would hope that he does as studied in the way of Christianity. I want him to understand the Old Testament, the New Testament, and how they differ from one another, but don't negate one another. Just because prophets, for example, like he mentioned before, were following the law does not mean that they as well do not attain salvation. He mentioned things like Jesus worshipping himself because he has a divine nature and a human nature. That is illogical. We don't believe that God does anything that's illogically based. So it would not make any sense for Jesus to worship himself his divine nature, sorry, as a human. We Christians worship the divine nature of God we, uh, and, and that is both in the Father, the Son and the Spirit. Just because Jesus didn't do the exact same thing when he was on earth does not mean that we can because don't forget, Jesus on earth worshiped the Father, accepted worship from the disciples and many other bystanders and said that you will be blaspheming if you insult the power of the Holy Spirit and as we know, we can only blaspheme if we insult God. So there you go, the three persons of God are present. Siraj's energy, I like him, but unfortunately intelligence is something that he lacks in. And then we go over to Islam, we talk about the two right hands. I ask him, why does Allah have two right hands? He can't tell me. For a long time we harped on about Allah descending to a lowest heaven in order to hear prayers. I asked him why, he couldn't tell me. I asked him why, does Muhammad say that Naftal looks like the devil? He couldn't tell me, even the shark 243. Tell me about the final, but I found it finally. I asked him why um, um, uh, Allah created Adam in his own, in his own image. And he's trying to tell me that like, um, like Allah created Adam in the image of Adam, which makes no sense because before you make something that doesn't exist, you require an archetype. So without there being an Adam, how can you then make Adam in the image of a, an Adam that doesn't exist? For example, if I said, I, I made the color red in the color red, that makes no sense because if red didn't exist, how can I make red out so it doesn't exist? In the same way, he said that, that, Christ, uh, that Islam, it's easy to understand Christianity makes no sense, it's illogical. But I would posit 
that ultimately there's nothing more illogical than believing in a God with two right hands who descends from his throne to hear you in, in the night time and let the prophet say that a black man look like a devil. What about flying for the, the donkey to Jerusalem? And, oh, sorry. And, and very finally, I asked him that uh, I asked him if he if he holds if the Isra mirage yeah. was a physical event or a spiritual maybe dreamlike event. Yeah. He holds that it's physical. Yeah. So I I posited the, the question that if Muhammad flew all the way to Alaska or, or, or the mosque in Alaska and it was in, in Jerusalem yeah. and as a result prayed there with the prophets, yeah. why was there no masjid? In in Jerusalem in the year 225 and why is the second oldest mosque in the entire world in Jerusalem that was completed in 705 so where did uh, did Muhammad pray with these um with these um prophets unless if he went into the future somehow while also on his night journey Islam unfortunately is highly logical and that is why I will not be following it anytime soon so that's Islam makes sense Islam makes as much sense as a uh, as a, 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 a square right circle. I was supposed to call two right hands, man. That's my problem. All right. Well, social family, thank you very much for listening. Appreciate it. All right.